and we are good to go. How is everyone doing today? Welcome to welcome to my channel. Thank you all for allowing me to kidnap you. What? <laughs> oh, oh, you didn't get the memo. I need to, I need to mute the tab because I'm hearing you twice, and I don't like that. <laughs> I mean, it, I mean, it would explain the handcuffs. Yeah, <laughs> you guys don't need your hands to play this game. <laughs> what handcuffs? Exactly, you've got the blindfold on. It's fine. Oh god. <laughs> uh, welcome everyone in. So we're gonna do ourselves a little bit of a do ourselves a little bit of a D and D game today. But this ain't no. This ain't your normal old five e. This ain't your your Pathfinders, your three point fives. Uh, we got ourselves a bit of a bit of a special project here today. Uh, see, for the longest time, uh, people have been trying to put, what are you, what, what is it, what is, oh, you're, you're I'm covering like, it, okay. <laughs> like, what are you doing? Are you, like, waiting for a high five? What's happening? No, I'm Illuminati, obviously. Ah, I'm fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for the longest time, yeah. everyone's like, you know, it'd be really cool, I want to play Sonic in D&D. &D. How do I do it? And then, usually everyone's like, oh, well, you want to go really fast, so, like, here's some monk levels and stuff. No more. We've got, uh, instead of putting, trying to fit Sonic into D&D, &D, why don't you try to fit your D&D &D into Sonic? We've got ourselves a, I, I should probably have checked to see when the game was made, but it's, it's still like in progress, so it hasn't been, hasn't been too long. This is a system called Rings and Running Shoes. Uh, it is uh, based out of the Powered by the Apocalypse engine. Um, you guys may recognize that as um, uh, some games like Masks and uh, City of Mist has a little bit of that DNA in it. Uh, very cool system, very good for uh, if you want something a little bit more narrative instead of like, you know, uh, chunky rules like movement speed and attack rolls and stuff like that. Uh, so I've gathered some people here and we're going to try a little bit of a one shot for it. Uh What's the oh? Before I get into it, I, I should I should gauge your guys' like in like how much you guys like Sonic. Do you guys have a favorite Sonic game? Starting with Alex. I wonder what game. Oh no! I... <laughs> please don't tell me. Uh, please tell me that it's not. No. Okay. Uh, it was, uh, it was... <laughs> I thought I would do the joke. Who? And how to end a friendship after twenty years? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Shut up, hedgehog. I like the gun. How to and kick someone from a Discord call? <laughs> <laughs> and we're kicking you out of the chai competition. <laughs> <laughs> and the broken mechanic. And all no. future campaigns. No, it's uh, it's a little game on. It was I think my first major introduction was on the DS. Uh, one of the old, old school like side scrolly ones. Uh, I, got, I think it was one of the adventure adventure games. Uh, it sounds like a Sonic Rush to me. Sonic well, I Rush think it was, Adventure. I think it might Sonic have been Rush Sonic adventure, Rush Adventure. Yeah, but, that... uh, yeah one, of, one of the old school like uh, side scrollers uh, on the DS. That was my, one of my games. That's so funny because the uh, the the fourth person that was going to join us for this was thinking about making a character from Sonic Rush Adventure. <laughs> And uh, now we'll have Super Mask. Oh, oh, he's gone. Uh, Charlie, do you have a favorite Sonic game? Sonic Heroes. Sonic Heroes, great yeah. choice. Underappreciated game, right there. Uh, from the from PlayStation Two. Yup, yup, yup. And now we game. and now we wait for Super Mask to you know uh, go play around with his stuff. And all right, he's back. There he is. Finally, yeah, finally. I can still hear you from across the room. <laughs> so yeah. What yeah, is? Uh, do you have a favorite Sonic game? Ooh, uh, probably the one that I particularly enjoyed the most would have to be Sonic Unleashed. Sonic Unleashed. You like uh, werewolves. Ooh. Yeah. That's a brave choice. Brave choice, bold. <laughs> That's one of those like in I think it was Tangled, like the meme where everyone starts I mean, pointing the swords the at first, you. It was the first one I played, so got some nostalgia for it. Yeah. That's good. You know, they uh, a lot of this game got a lot of inspiration from those kind of like side games and even the IDW comics, which means it this game is tapping into a knowledge base I have no idea on. Uh, 
I checked in with the the developer of the game, just like, hey, is it okay if I stream this? And his only instructions were, yeah, just don't do anything embarrassing, lol. So I'm like, all right, oh, I need you guys not to embarrass me in front of the wizards. <laughs> uh. All right, I think uh, let's let's get into it, and then once we've introduced our characters, we can uh, we we'll get a little bit more into the uh, the finer details of the game, shall we? So we uh, we will start off uh, with a scene. It was kind of like fading in uh, on a nice day, and I believe the place is Mystic Ruins, and somebody, a certain somebody, has got a workshop here. Uh, Supermask, who who would this character be? And what are they up well, to? Uh, well, uh, this is probably one of the most like like well-known characters because he's literally Sonic's first friend and psychic yep. in both the games and the movies. It is Tails. I am playing as Tails. Heck yeah. yeah. And, and the in the game, they, instead of classes, like in a D&D standpoint, you'd think like fighters and rogues and stuff. Uh, what is your, uh, I don't know what the actual term for it is, but what is your quote-unquote class? Well, uh, if this is correct, I believe Tails is the Tinker class. That is correct. Uh, and the Tinker has all kinds of stuff uh, that lets them like make stuff on the fly and like has a specific, oh god, now I'm hearing myself twice, <laughs> uh, uh, ha like has like a dedicated... Uh, machine that they can use to like fight and do other stuff with. Uh, would you like to introduce that now, or would you like to uh, surprise us with that later? Well, uh, the the thing I've made to assist me in the fight is a little is a little pet robot dog that is named Teapot. Yeah. Uh, do you have that image on you, real quick, that you can throw to the other people? Uh, if not, uh, I can grab it. Yeah. If you have it, then probably be quicker to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Than I can. If you give me two minutes, I'm just going to switch to the iPad because I'm cutting out every few minutes. No problem. I'm going to switch to the iPad. No, no. I'll be right back. All right. Uh, and then what is what is Tails up to in his workshop today? Just oh. a normal, everyday, nothing, you know, just nice and peace and quiet. Sonic's not been around for a bit, so. Yeah, just nice and peace and quiet. I mean, he's just uh, fixing the tornado. I think that's what the plane is called. Heck yeah. 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 All right. And uh, while we wait for Alex, uh, someone else is also at this workshop. Uh, Charlie, who are you going to be playing as today? I'm playing as um, Cream. Heck yeah. Cream the rabbit. Yeah. Uh, and uh, you've got uh, Cheese the Chow with you as well. Yep. Nice. Okay. And then, so if Su if Tails was the Tinker, which class do you have? Clumsy. That's true. So the clumsy is a bit of a is uh, instead of thinking of these like D and D classes, think of these more as like uh, like roles in a book or a movie. So you could have yeah, like support. exactly. I'm more, I'm more uh, support than anything else. Yeah, uh, clumsies are kind of somewhere between like a joke character and a support, and lets them do all kinds of like shenanigans to the rules. Uh, we've picked some of the like easier to use roles for Cream today, but uh, do you uh, do you want to explain what the thing is with the dice rolls, or do you want me to explain it? <laughs> no problem. So the clumsy is, has a really cool rule where whenever somebody rolls a 1 on the d6, this is a 2d6 system, by the way, so you guys will roll 2d6 and then add what I tell you to add. Um, but whenever a, roll, a 1 comes up on either of the dice, uh, Cream will get a, a, like, a, like a point to use to throw into someone else's roll or her own rolls to make them better. Uh, it, it's usually the idea of like joke characters being able to make a joke out of like you know silly situations, and but also are, like kind of lucky and stumble upon uh, doing the right thing. And uh, what what do you think that you're doing at the workshop today? Do you think you uh, do you think you came over to see tales or uh, you think uh, do you come out here to hang out? 
Um, probably just to um, hang out with cheese and just maybe just give it a little, give it some cheese, a little snack. Heck yeah. There. Cheese is always ready for more snacks. Uh, <laughs> and what about our third person? Who else is at this workshop? I don't know how much of the context you've gotten, but uh, I can re-explain things. Um, I, I, I don't think I've missed quite a bit. Oh, no. Hold on. D can you check your microphone? <laughs> you sound like you're underwater. We're not at that part of the game yet. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> Someone start playing the, the, like, the time running out music when you're underwater. ba 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 Tech oh, and while I'm uh, while we're uh, working on that, I forgot to mention: if you put in exclamation Sonic in the chat right now, you will get the link to the to the game that we're using. Uh, and you can go there; uh, it's for there. Thank you very much, Super. Uh, you can go there and throw uh, some support their way with a donation, but you can also get the rules for free. How how are you sound in there, Alex? Hello, hello, testing, testing. Nope. Um, Sorry. <laughs> Ah, I was trying to connect <laughs> other headphones that were better, but they're not connecting via... Oh, <laughs> I think we may have lost you completely now. And, and for some reason, my Siri keeps going off. And I don't know why my Siri keeps going off. I just don't want Siri to keep going off. Right, give me like two minutes. I'm going to try and... No problem. Open. <laughs> uh... I, I should mention that I you know I'm not affiliated with the developer of the game. I just uh, you know I I calls him as I sees him, and I see myself a good game right here. Um, while he's working on that, I think we should go ahead and get ourselves into our story today. Uh, so tails, maybe you're working on the plane, and you're and you see uh, something coming down in the distance. Uh, it looks like some kind of like machine with like a trail of smoke coming down from it and is crashing into the beach nearby uh what do you do super uh you uh tail sees a, a plane coming or like not a plane but like some kind of flying metal object coming down and is crashing into the beach nearby What do you do? Oh, should I, should I, invest, I will investigate it. You sure should. Uh, so you head down, and uh, it looks like... Uh, out, out, it's hard to see it at first with the smoke, but you quickly recognize that this is Eggman's, uh, you know, like, trademark flying device. And who else has crashed onto the beach but Eggman, who's kind of in, like, a... Like a comical, like kind of butt up into the air kind of pose, and is groaning in the sand. <laughs> ah, ah, ow! All right, where did I land? Oh, uh, tails, it's you. Okay, I need your help. Is Sonic around? No, and why should I trust you? Ah, just, uh, just... <laughs> all right, that's fair. Tails. Uh, look. I need your I need your all's help. This isn't a trick. There's no there's no pranks. I'm not trying to harm anybody. Uh I I need I need help getting my island back. The egg the egg carrier islands, which I've been using as one of my bases, this is like my private island, has been taken over by one of my mechs. Uh the egg renegade, one of my greatest creations, which now I is I a little ironic considering it's gone rogue, but it has, uh, someone's taken the mech and is threatening to terrorize the island, and I need you all to help me. Is anybody else here besides you? Well, there's, uh, well, there's cream, cheese, and shadow, but... <laughs> Speaking of which, how is, uh, how's the microphone down there? Hello, testing. Yay! Yay! <laughs> right, there you go. I knew this headset would be a bit better. I don't know why, but... Sometimes it just fucks up. I do look like a fighter pilot, but we'll we'll take what we're given with. Exactly. <laughs> sure. 
Sure, Captain speaking. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a. this is a uh, I think a perfect cue as Tails has just mentioned that someone else is here. Uh, who else is here, Alex? I am Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> 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 I'm doing this voice for the whole duration. I'm no, sure I'm... your throat's gonna love that. <laughs> Uh, that's why I've got several cans of drink with me. Yep. Because <laughs> I know I'm going to just tear my throat up. Um, yeah, uh, as like Tail goes, and there's Shadow. Shadow is just headphones on, just working on his motorbike, singing to himself. <laughs> no care in the world. Heck yeah. I gotta drain my oil. I gotta drain the oil. I gotta drain the oil today. Do, 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 do. <laughs> oh, thank goodness Shadow is here. Not that I don't trust you, Tails, on your own, but we could really use the extra muscle here. This is, island is heavily fortified, and I don't know if you and a little girl and a, a, their pet chow is going to make it. Um, he just goes, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Shadow! Shadow, please help me. I am begging for what your is, help. With what? Uh, my <laughs> island's been taken over by a mech, as someone's taken my mech and is threatening to destroy the island, and I could really use your help. Okay. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tails, you're on board, I assume, as well. <laughs> All right. Excellent. See, I know. I was taking. I was taking a drink. Sorry. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. I know you. I just need my coffee. <laughs> I drink my coffee oh, my black, <laughs> like my soul. <laughs> Damn it, that's oh, the joke no. I was gonna do. Yeah. No. Uh, uh, thank you. So I knew, I knew you. You know, you're, you, you two are so selfless and such good heroes. I knew you'd help me, even, even though I'm your long lasting, your long lasting rival. Um, and then also, I guess you have the, the, the bunny. Uh, please, if, <laughs> if you could bring her, who knows? Uh, her and the Chow could be, could be useful. <laughs> Ah, yes, the two and the other one. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so before we get into, before we get into, like, the big scene itself, uh, I'm, gonna, so I'm going mean. to... Do what? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, did you, I'm sorry, did you hear something? <laughs> Is Cream taking weed? Oh. <laughs> well, well, I think Cream might have been finding that reefer me, you know what I mean? Oh, God. <laughs> You're so mean! <laughs> mean! Oh, you, oh mean. I mean! I thought you said I'm, ta I thought you said I'm taking weed. I'm not, I'm not mean, I this is- I thought you said you were weed! <laughs> we're like, I'm sorry, what, what, why is Cream uh, 420 and blazing it? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Cream is literally the youngest character in the series, so it's, true. it's like, uh, she shouldn't be. I'm not. I'm not mean. being mean. No, I'm not being mean. I'm. This is the nicest I've ever been. I swear. Uh, Cause I'm begging for your all's help. Uh, Shadow goes vouch. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know what I could do for a reward. Maybe. Maybe there's something on the island that you guys would want. I'm just. I, I'm really just banking on goodwill here. Uh, Fair enough. Before we get into the big action scene itself, uh, I'm going to give you guys an opportunity here. There's a Yar. there's a cool thing. There's a cool mechanic in this game called uh, establish a set piece. It lets the other players come up with something, and if they do, they get progress to doing something cool. Uh, kind of like an like an inspiration in a five e kind of thing, mm. but better. Mm -hmm. um, so, uh, as Eggman is going to explain the defenses of the island and the mech itself, the Egg Renegade, is there something that you guys as players would like to introduce as, like, this is something that might come up, this is a bad guy that might be there, or a trap, <laughs> or something about the boss? Maybe, um, like, a rumor you heard about the island. Hmm. Oh, I have nothing. <laughs> Not a problem. Uh, the island, the what well, the the island the Eggman's been like. It's overrun. It's overtaken. Yeah, that one. That one. Uh, okay. The island itself uh, is based on a uh, it's based on a volcano that uh, that uh, that erupts. It doesn't erupt lava because that's too hot. It right. erupts. Hmm. Once it erupts, it erupts. <laughs> Uh, whipped cream. Amazing. 
I will I I will take I will take your uh your set piece under advisement but to show how to show that it's good for the players to introduce these things on your character sheet uh there's a spot that says momentum or maybe it's like abbreviated uh to something like that but it's got like five little squares uh yep. fill up two of those you got two of your five and mm-hmm. I'll ha- uh uh Alex does Ah, uh, I'm just finding it. Give me a hot minute. No problem. I had to close <laughs> down a bunch of shit. I just realized one, I've got the wrong music moment. going. I, I, I hope I that doesn't show up on moment. the stream. There I'm doing to turn down Charlie because you are blowing my eardrums. Oh well. Uh, all yeah. right. <laughs> just, a, just, a, just a little bit, just because you're a bit loud. Just in my head. It might be my headphones. It just spill out. There you go. Very possible. Uh, and while I'm looking this up, I'm gonna lo- uh, while I'm thinking about this, I'm gonna look up to see what happens when you get all five. Because I know what it's called. It's called a ring, uh, which is this game's equivalent of like inspiration, but it's better uh, because I believe it lets you, including a couple other things, it lets you treat a roll as if it was a twelve, which is the best yeah. you can do. Uh, That's my sheet. And there is that. What am I looking at? What am I looking at? <laughs> you are looking. So there should be a and spot. Then. Yes. I'm sorry, I missed that entirely. M M, one of the green diamonds. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. M M. Yep. That is momentum, because you know mm-hmm. the, those Sonic fans, they love them some momentum. Uh, and when you get all five, you get the ring. Which lets you do, uh, which lets you. The next thing you do will be, or the, the, what you put it, whatever you put it towards, uh, is way better. And there's some other ways mm-hmm. to get momentum as well, which I'll explain. Uh, so yeah, let's get into it. Uh, Eggman is uh, brings out a uh, like a like a robotic boat, basically uh, that he has like his little egg pond robots driving, and he and he like invites you guys onto the boat to get you guys to egg carrier island unless tails wants to take his uh ship or his uh his tornado Mm -hmm. to which i would ask uh super mask if he uh does tails want to take his take the tornado or is he planning on uh is he just planning on going on the boat uh I thought he was <laughs> I think like Tails should not take the tornado. Okay. Yeah, because it sounds like you were... Re- take the boat. It sounds like you're repairing it, so it's probably not ready yeah. for flight right now. Okay. Yeah, no, it's not. So you guys take the... You guys take uh, Eggman's, like, robotic ship over with him, and he's mm-hmm. explaining that the... <laughs> Sorry, listen, I don't know why that... Uh, I don't know why that popped up. Uh... So the island it's or he along the way he's ex- explaining that the 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 mech the egg renegade he's kind of going through the specs with tails because tails knows his robotic stuff and the uh, he explains the mech is like a giant like twenty foot tall mech there's a spot inside for someone to drive it and uh, it's got like two big you know you know springs right the things that you bounce on it's got two really big one of those as fists. Uh, and a- Eggman explains that the entire <laughs> uh, explains that the entire island is basically tailor made to stop Sonic. Luckily, none of you guys are Sonic, so hopefully it's not going to be as big of a deal for you guys. Uh, so Eggman's like, "Well, best of luck. I'm going to be staying here. Uh, all of the robots have completely went out, uh, lost. I've lost control of all the robots. Whoever's driving the mech has." manually taking control of all of them so they're on a rampage and hate me good good luck good luck you guys got this uh i'll i'll be i'll be here to give guidance along the communicators if uh if there's anything i can do to explain things have fun have fun storming the base <laughs> oh joy as usual eggman is leading us to our death again no no i swear there's no intentional me trying to send you into anything this time this is all completely accidental if you end up being killed. And I'm not going to take any pleasure from this, except the fact that it was my creations, but 
It's less fun. Now, it's entirely your fault. What do you want about it? <laughs> Uh, you should blame whoever whoever's driving the mech right now. I I would blame them. Uh hmm. So you guys make it onto the island which uh the the place has kind of been built up. Uh Tails has actually been here once in Sonic Adventure. Uh it used to be just like a little like out, uh, away base, but now it's got like big towers built up into it and like classic sonic uh sonic level stuff like loop-de-loops and spikes mm-hmm. and springs everywhere so you guys are gonna have to uh you, you, you guys are all familiar with how this works uh this isn't gonna be anything new to you you guys know how to get through Eggman's obstacles and stuff like that so let's start to talk mechanics shall we uh if you guys look on that sheet that has the basic moves uh yes. listen i don't know what you're talking about uh there's uh <laughs> There's a couple of the core moves. Uh, one of them is make it through, which is kind of just like whenever there's a like a in a tense or dangerous situation, you use that to get through uh, like either dangerous uh, obstacles or things like that. Uh, so why don't we get a little starter with each of you guys rolling uh, make it through, which would be plus style. The I believe five stats in this game are style. Force, there's Mystic, but that's at the end. Attitude and Smarts. I have, I have zero, so it's fine. Yep. Right, so, so go ahead and throw those into guys. the... Uh, oh, so that'll be exclamation R, 2d6, plus whatever your bonus is. I will be right back. And the bonus is style. Yes. So I'm just trying to refund the trying sheet. Trying to go the whole stream without the air conditioner on. Did not work. Is it, did it become immediately too hot? Immediately too hot. Uh, probably me wearing a long sleeve shirt's not helping either. No. Uh, where's the you send... Jesus. What was it? Oh, uh, no, we're not that one. <laughs> 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 I was going to say, where, where did you put the move sheet? Cause I can't, is, it, is it in the first PDF you sent me? Uh, it is in sheets if you go to our Discord there. Uh, okay, hold on. Yep, yep. Uh, but while oh, you're, no. While you're doing that... <laughs> Tails, you you know uh, Eggman's robots inside and out. He has to throw. He has to have something real special to get by you. So you're able to start making your way through this place without any trouble at all. Uh, uh, Cream, however, you know not as experienced as the as the others. Uh, but luckily that was a one, so you do get one clumsy point or karma point, I believe is what they call it. Uh, so... What am I roll- Sorry, what am I rolling for? Style. Which is... Oh, well, uh, style is kind of like a defensive, like... This um, is... Style, sorry. I heard dial. I was like, what the fuck <laughs> He's rolling Totodile. <laughs> That's Pokemon <laughs> D&D. Uh... Style. Style, style, style. It's totally sorry, right. continue. Continue your point. No problem. I'm fine. Uh, so... Uh, Cream will be able to put that karma point towards a future roll, and will be able to like use that maybe to bump up uh, a failure to a success, or even uh, a mixed success to a full success. Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, things are going to go bad for her, and I should make the, I should have the rules up on my phone. That way, I don't have to. I I make sure that I'm actually playing this correctly. Lamel. Uh, but what's going to happen is that Creams is uh, is has made like, gotten noticed by a group of egg pond robots, uh, which look like this. Where'd that art? Oh, go? hang on, I found it. Two, uh, two, two, I I I have one. So do I plus one? You do get plus one. Nice. And I'll throw that in the command so people can see it. Well, hopefully. If my internet decides it wants to load, oh, I made this window mm. way too small for these pictures. Yeah, I'm uh, okay. It's it's not happening. Okay, let me use my phone. Cool. Hold on. Whose internet decided to crap out on them today? <laughs> me. I was gonna reset it, but I thought I don't really want to have to uh, reset it and wait forever for it to reconnect. While he's working on that, I should explain that since this game is more narrative, 
uh, you guys are able to like split up if you want to accomplish different things. Um, oh no, you're only going that one. Yep. Uh, I should I should mention that in order for Cream to get the plus one from Shadow's roll, she has to be there with him. So mm. it's up to you guys if you want to say you were running together or uh, if you guys split up. Well, I can fly, so. True. Yeah. Well, yeah, screw you. Group can fly except for Shadow. <laughs> well, screw you both then, a holes. <laughs> uh, uh, so well, it sounds like you guys have split up a little bit. So yeah, uh, Cream is has been surrounded by these egg pond robots, and Shadow, you've kind of gotten into a spot that's like with a bunch of spikes around it, and there's these flying Eggman robots that are shooting like like stun things at you. Uh, so, uh, Tails, do you think you see either of these going on? Uh, should I, or? That's uh, up to you. <laughs> should should <All> right. you? <laughs> well, uh, nah, I'm just gonna ignore them. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm just gonna be a dick and ignore you. No, I'm gonna, obviously gonna help them. Uh, Shadow and Cream. Okay. Uh, they kind of look like they're in, like, two separate situations right now, so you might only Thank have time you. to help one of them out at the moment. Thank you. Uh, which Sorry, is, repeat that because I uh, sneezed. No problem. Uh, it's yeah. not. It looks like since they're kind of separated, uh, you you only have time to help one of them out for now. Uh, which of the two are you going to go help out? Uh, cream. No, understandable. Shadow can take care of himself. Shadow can take care of himself. <laughs> I, it's fine. Uh, so while Cream is starting to get like surrounded by these uh, egg pond robots who have like these shields and these like big lances. Uh, uh, l let's have you jump in to help out. What are you, uh, uh, what are you gonna do to, to hit these guys? If or are you just gonna try to get cream out of there? Well, first, um, well, what can I do? Let's see. I'm gonna use a. Uh... And this is a narrative game, so instead of thinking of it from like, what moves do I have? What stats are really good? Describe it in character. And then I'll tell you what to roll from there. All right, Tails is going to a. Uh... Are these like flying robots, right? Uh, not these. These are on the ground. They're like they're like Eggman's foot soldiers. Spin dash. Spin dash. Heck yeah! Uh, in that case, this sounds like it's going to be a kick butt roll, uh, which is kind of like your basic combat roll in this game. Uh, so that'll be plus. Uh, I mean, it sounds if you're doing spin dash, that sounds like plus force. So go ahead and roll that. 2d6 plus whatever your force stat is. Oh, dear. You use force. No. Uh, it, force is... You don't really want to consider it strength, but... Uh, oh. oh, hey, you know what? It works. A 7 to 9 is a mixed success. Uh, so you go in there and you try to spin dash, but one of these guys blocks it with the shield uh, and like kind of sends the two of you skid it, like, you know, sliding away from each other. Uh, so you didn't make any progress, but this game has a battle counter. So every turn, every time there's a mixed success and nothing gets done, uh, or if both sides get hurt, but in this case nothing got done, I move the counter up to by one, and then the next person to roll kick butt gets a plus one on their roll, and that keeps going up the longer the fight goes. Because you guys are heroes, you guys, uh, you guys should be able to uh, take these guys out no problem. Uh, let's jump to Cream then. Cream, Tails uh, is uh, helping you out, and uh, Cheese looks very scared, but he's ready to help you out. Uh, what what are you gonna do against these robots? Oh, throwing cream! Hell yeah! <laughs> uh, for those that need, for those of you that aren't aware, uh, one of my favorite bits in Sonic is that Cheese is actually really powerful, and Cream can just yeet. Uh, yeet cheese or tell cheese to go like get somebody <laughs> and cheese will just like beat the snot out of somebody uh, go ahead and <laughs> you're going to do a kick butt roll as well uh, yours will be plus attitude attitude is the charisma stat of this game oh, use that okay. to, to tell buddies what to do <sighs> and to you know like intimidate people um, 2d6 yep Plus 
Oh dear. Hey, but that's a uh, that's another one for you. Mm. Uh, in fact, if you if you use one of your karma points, you could take that nine to a ten, and you'll get a full success. Yeah. All right. So, uh, Alex, could I get you to bring the mic a little bit further away from the face, please? Thank yeah, you. I feel right now. Because uh, well, I, uh, I can't hear it back. That's the problem. I'm, mm. I, I'm not sure where to move it. Uh, the, so if it's, is it all right here? Yes, that is fine. Okay. Uh, I don't know where to move it. I'm like, Ugh. No problem. And it's far from me to uh, to be the, the judge of mic quality. Uh, if I say what it'll do, though, people in the VOD will be like, oh, no, now I'm hearing it all the time. Uh <laughs> Uh, That's fine. Yeah. I, 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 I can hear only. I can only hear it back on the Xbox. I can't hear it when it's plugged into the uh, Excellent. iPad. So, so, so apologies. Cream, you're know. using yeah. one of those karma points. Yep. Excellent. So that takes your nine up to a ten. A ten is a full success. You get everything you want out of it. Uh, so cheese just rips into one of these guys and like does his own little spin dash, bounces off the the robot's head. And then just does a little cheer, like, chow, chow. Uh, you have destroyed one of the robots. There are now two left on your side. Uh, let's jump. Let's go see what Shadow's up to. Uh, Shadow, uh, there is about three of these uh, robots, and there are spikes around. Uh, okay. So I have a move called uh, Attention All Scrubs. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and that is from your class. Uh, yes. So why don't you tell us which, what your class is? I am the handsome, the devilish rogue. <laughs> <laughs> At your service. Perfect for As all the lancers in the world. <laughs> um, and so, and so, everyone gets two of these class-specific moves, and he's using one of them now. Uh, so, what does attention all scrubs do? Uh, when you want to curse your enemy with the most aggressive or smug of statements, uh, roll attitude, and then I get, like, bonuses on, like, uh, if I hit over a certain score. So it's plus my attitude, which I don't have. Uh, okay. uh, but on a 7 plus, you can pick one of the options from a list below. So, uh, I get to either make a misfire or mishandle one of their defenses for a short bit. If any has no defenses, you either destroy them or move on to the next phase. On a 7 to 9, enemies rage is stronger than you expected in an unpredictable way. On a miss, you fail and you aren't considered it, and are considered the joke or a non threat in front of everyone. And you take one damage. Uh, I ignore armor completely. And you can't use that attitude on anyone present during the use of this move until the end of the stage. Got it. And I can't get assists on this. So, you, did you mention that this move hits all the enemies, or just one? Uh, when you want to curse your enemy, it just says your enemy. Okay, well that's fine. We'll make it work to we'll make it work on all these robots that are here. So go ahead and roll attitude. Okay. Oh god, please let please let this fucking work. Please let Jesus. this work. <laughs> I have a funny joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get any bonuses. Hey! That'll work. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So an A. Mm -hmm. So what is the effect on a seven plus? Uh, seven plus. You can pick one of the options from a list below. You can provoke the enemy to do an immediate, uh, simple action of your choosing, or you can force them to misfire or mishandle one of their defenses. Uh, uh, and if they don't have any defenses, I just destroy them. Nice. Or move them on to the next phase. These guys do have defenses. Uh, the they, they fly. Uh, how this game works. Uh, Enemies either have like multiple things of HP or they have defenses. Something you have to get around or deal with before you are able to kick their butt. Uh, yeah. So usually you'd have to either attack them or attack their defenses to get it out of the way. Mm. Uh, so with that in mind, are you going to get rid of one of their defenses? They're flying? Or are you going to do one of those other things you said? Uh, I'm going to get rid of one of their... Uh, I'm going to get rid of their defenses, and I'm going to stop them all from flying. Heck yeah, so uh, I imagine that you provoke them. Uh, what do you say to them? Uh, I say, hey, you flying bitches. <laughs> Taste my <laughs> flying sisters. God, <laughs> make it, having Shadow say the word bitches is funny. Um, <laughs> <Come> on, you <laughs> bitches. <laughs> uh... 
they, they are apparently very receptive to uh to being called bitches and uh angrily like fly down to try to like shoot you closer but that means that they have in fact uh they have in fact gotten close enough so their flying's not a defense anymore uh why don't we keep the action with you what uh what else are you going to be doing um okay i uh i'm gonna kick butt okay uh because it says here i have power trap you can kick butt against every every enemy within your ability range Uh, if those enemies have any defenses you would need to exclude them which i've just done yep it's almost like i planned this (laughs) (laughs) uh you exclude them from the attack or take the take the consequences so i could just kick their ass now absolutely yeah and because so every character has a type uh, think of it like a Sonic Heroes uh, speed flying power type, but yep. uh, so Shadow is a power type which lets him kick butt against multiple dudes. Uh, so yes. yeah, let's see. Uh, how are you going to be kicking these people's butt? Doesn't always have mm-hmm. to be by force. Could be sneaking away from them. Could be all kinds of things. Hmm. And what Good you point. say uh, will depend on well decide what stat i make you roll so is it so just is it just in the sort of the first box exactly uh, okay let me see uh... Uh, can i can i just hit them you sure can <laughs> i'm just gonna hit them you know what i'm like what do i do <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, let's see a kick butt with force then. Force. Force. Uh, okay. Good. Good. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> I like to hear it. <laughs> it's not entirely my in my wheelhouse, but there we go. I might regret putting a certain skill into it. You, you can always certain skill. <laughs> if you can think of a way to use kick butt with a different stat, like attitude or smarts, then uh, you can you can do that. Like maybe you build something to like to shoot them with, or you like hack them or something. I was just gonna hit him with my motorbike. Oh yeah, no, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> He's just I going just around in his motorbike. <laughs> yeah, my motorbike. Chainsaw. Ah! Chainsaw. Chainsaw. <laughs> what is it's this? A, dead it's... rising? <laughs> so, so because of each of the wheels, they turn into each blade, and it has a long gated stick. So it's just a big hell old yeah. Motorbike chainsaw. So smart. Oh my god! Turns out using a giant motorcycle chainsaw is an effective weapon. Uh, (laughs) (laughs) Who knew? Who knew? Uh, So yeah, so because you rolled a 12 plus, if you ever have a way to make something a star attribute, which none of us have right now, but Mm. if you ever do get that in the future, that would be the perfect success. Get everything you want out of the situation. But yeah. luckily, you you already pretty much handled the situation by yourself. <laughs> you, I, went, I just went, I got my motorbike, pulled out an edge, and then just, Tails probably heard a, <laughs> and he went, huh? Uh, and I was beating the living crikes. <laughs> yep, these guys are reduced to puddles of oil and bolts by the time you're done with them. <laughs> uh, let's jump back to Tails and Cream. Uh, who's going first? Go on, Tails. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alright then. Well, fair enough then. If you want me to go first, then yeah. There are two robots left that are uh, harassing you two. Uh, or three, if you count cheese. Which you should, because <laughs> I like cheese. He's a cool guy. Well, right, free if you can't. I'm, right, I'm gonna go for cheat. No, I'm kidding. I'm gonna go for cheat. <laughs> I'm gonna punch I'm cheese. Gonna go for cheese. Wham! <laughs> the weapon. Yeah, it's just. <laughs> uh oh, uh-oh. he's getting a he's getting a prop, ladies yeah, so and just gentlemen. Pretend this there you go. Cheese. It's just... Oh, I, I don't have to pretend. <laughs> he's right up there. Uh, oh, he's, oh, he can't. He's hiding oh, behind. Geez. He's hiding behind. He's hanging around. He's hanging around. Right, I'm just gonna around. go for a spin dash into those two robots. Heck yeah! Let's see a kick butt with let's force. Do it. Whoa! 
Oof. Now, somebody if somebody has karma points, they could change that into a 7, so it's not a total failure, so Tails doesn't get hurt. What's the karma point? That's something <laughs> that Cream has. I don't, uh, I, Cream, help him. <laughs> I, use one, I use one of mine. I can use the other one. Yep. So what, does that put you back at zero? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, uh, with a little bit of Cream's luck, Tails is able to avoid uh, getting stabbed by one of these big lances. Uh, and uh, Or maybe Cream does something to like get Tails out of the way. Uh, but So neither of them take damage. The battle counter goes up to two. Ah, I forgot to add the battle counter. All right, I'll remember this time. Uh, basically, for the rest of this fight, you guys get two plus two to your rolls. To kick butt. Okay. Yeah, cool. yeah, yeah. Uh, Cream, it is now your turn. Hmm. I'll think of. What was it? I could uh, say you're so mean. <laughs> 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 uh, she's referring to a move that she has, but I think that it might be a little late for that, considering the. Well, I guess there's still two robots left. I'll let you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'll let you. Uh, I'll let you use it if you want. Can you uh, read it for us? When it confronted or surrounded by <laughs> enemies, you can throw a fit at, and appeal that for their emotional side, it, even if they are not. Have no emotions. Roll a, an attitude or, or a 10 plus. The enemy will consider you friendly until proven otherwise and will follow a single simple command. On 7 to 9, the battle is completely stopped and the enemy will retreat to fight you later. On a miss, pick a teammate. They have to run and save you, putting them in danger. Yep. So basically what's happening is that uh, Cream is going to like, uh, you guys are mean robots and they're going <laughs> to, but like just for sheer force of being cute, the robots are going to stop and like consider you. Uh, I'm going to go. So go ahead and roll Attitude. Oh dear. Can you imagine um, they just start cooing? Uh, cooing cream, and you just hear Shadow go, <laughs> motorbike chainsaw. <laughs> Plus. That's a nine. Nine. So, what happens on a seven to nine? Um. Hang on. On seven to nine, the battle will completely. It completely stops, and and the enemy will be will retreat to fight you later, or fight me later. Yep. So the ro so the robots are like coming in to to like get you with these big lances. Uh, so do you say anything to them to make them uh to make them like stop to hear you out? Nini, stop. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the robots, do the two robots just kind of like look to each other, like these just like motionless faces, <laughs> like what? <laughs> uh, uh, and hmm. they just like they hmm. they like pause for a couple more moments, like they're trying to think about it, and then they just kind of like immediately turn around and start yeah. walking off. <laughs> so you have now you you have uh, saved yourself from the robots there. Uh, the battle is over, so I will uh, drop the battle counter back to zero. And press the button. <laughs> press the button. That was easy. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so now you guys are once again able to continue on. Uh, let's see. How do I want to go about this? Yeah. Um, as you guys are continuing on, you're able to make through the rest of this uh, immediate area without too much more trouble. Uh, and you come to a big, like, metal shuttle, like, shutter door that's kind of, like, blocking the path. It looks, like, deeper into the base. Uh, and near, and kind of near it uh, is, like, a like some patches of grass and beach that looks like a bunch of, like, palm trees and stuff like that. Why Eggman has palm trees on the on this island seems a bit strange. He's not really a tree guy. 
Uh, <laughs> so either if is you, anyone is anyone a tree guy? <laughs> probably. There's probably some naturey people. This is Sonic we're talking about. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Weird <laughs> trees. So, if you guys are wanting to get into this base, in parentheses, you are, you can eat, uh, you can start to, like, work on that, or you can roll uh, smarts to find out more about the situation. Um, I roll smarts. I, I, I roll smarts. Why Heck not? yeah, do it. Smarts are good. Well, considering I've just made a change to a motorbike, I think... <laughs> That's what he was working on when he was uh, touching up his motorcycle. We thought he was yeah, fixing yeah. it. He's turning it into a chainsaw. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, there's a door right there. <laughs> <laughs> so there is a list of questions that you can ask on the Find Out More. But mm -hmm. uh, basically, just ask me for a clue or a question, and I will get. I have to straight up give you an answer. Okay, where is the door? <laughs> uh, well, the door is right in front of you, but I, I imagine there's something a bit more specific you're wanting to ask. Okay, uh, how, how do we get in the door? Uh, is there a code? Is there like a path? Do you have to knock and go password? Do you have to do a little dance? What? <laughs> besides, besides the obvious of brute forcing your way in, although none of you guys are like super duper strong to be able to do that, not all in one go anyway, uh... It seems that there's a... You might be able to, like, hack into the place, though that might set off some alarms or, like, defenses. Alter Tails. Alternatively, <laughs> there is an emergency yeah. override through an underwater gauntlet. <laughs> ah, I'm, I'm so glad we have override button. Also called Tails. <laughs> <laughs> Gladly, consider it done. <laughs> oh, right. yes, our favorite override button, Tails. <laughs> So this is going to this is basically another fight. So uh, you're gonna be uh, you're go basically you're gonna be kicking butt with uh, smarts to try to like hack into this place. Uh, I should mention though, this does have some defenses. As like tails is like starting to like hijack it, he can tell that this has an alarm system, which will send in reinforcements, and it also has like a laser defense grid, which will activate if he screws this up. So. Do you want to do you want to go after one of those defenses first or do you want to go straight for the door though you might get hurt in the process? Defenses. Got it. Do you want to go after the def the laser defense or the uh the re like the alarm? The alarm first. Got it. Yep, go ahead and roll kick butt and you'll be adding your <laughs> smarts to this. Yeah. Heck yeah. Uh, yeah. 10 plus, that'll absolutely take out one of the defenses. So the alarm has been, like, just before the alarm's about to set off, you, like, you're able to hack into it and take it out. So the you shouldn't be expecting any more, uh, any more reinforcements to give you any trouble. Uh, who is next? So, uh, 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 Cream, has Cream done anything? At the moment? Not at the moment. Uh, I'll let Cream go first, and then if if they can't think of anything, I'll go. Okay, I'll give it. I'll I'll give it a go. Yeah. Uh, what is it that you? Uh, what would it? What would you like to do? Um, push buttons. <laughs> push but heck yeah. <laughs> uh, Maybe I shouldn't have let Cream go first. <laughs> would Would you like? Hmm. Go ahead and give me just a straight 2d6 roll, please. But if you succeed, I'm going to give you, a, like, a really good benefit. <laughs> Shocker. Oh, my God. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, before, before I go into this, I should mention there's one other thing I forgot from the, pre the past fight. Every time you guys use a different stat move, like if you use smarts, then you use force, then you use something else, yeah. you get a point of momentum for each time you've used a new stat. So okay, cool. all, all of you guys have one extra momentum, and then I think nice. that's it, because I don't think anyone changed up their... Actually, no. Uh, 
Tails also has another one because he used smarts. Yeah. What so I used smarts I have... earlier. Did you use smarts have, earlier? Um... Yeah, I'm motorbike chainsaw. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> I, I, yeah, fair enough. Uh, yeah, go ahead and give yourself an extra one there too. Excellent. What, what about... So I've got one or two. I think you just have one, because I think you've only done add. Oh, actually, I'll give you one for this uh, push and buttons, because that was really funny. So you have two more as well. <laughs> so I have, I, I have two yep. now. Uh, so let me know whenever you guys hit five, then we'll talk. Uh, uh, so right. now, now you guys can keep in mind that doing new things, new or cooler things, gives you more momentum. Mm -hmm. So you don't always want to fall back to your good stat. Uh, exactly. Okay. So yeah. I, well, do you, do you want to okay. explain what happens, or do you what would you like me to? <laughs> uh, you can do that. All right. <laughs> so cream, I imagine just like, ooh, what's this button do? And you hit something, <laughs> and then the the automated system is just like activating a lot activating laser grid and now there are just lasers <laughs> cutting across the area uh you're fine but now the lasers are like actively a problem uh shadow what do i look at cream and go we were so close <laughs> we were so close why did you have to press shit great um, how far how far away is cheese from me? <laughs> uh, cheese is over by cream, so I'll let you decide how close you want to be. The lasers going off. I, I'm I'm I, I so uh, have we entered the room? And I'm guessing we're in the edge of a room, and there's a laser grid in front of us. Yeah. Okay, I grab cheese. <laughs> uh, this bet this better be a pretty dang good explanation as to why you're grabbing and this cute little chow. I, I, I'm going to I'm going to look for the. I'm going to look for the disarm button <laughs> to throw cheese at it. <laughs> uh, you're going to have to go ahead and roll attitude because cheese, cheese don't get thrown by nobody. And um, you got to be buddies with cheese. I offer her cheese. <laughs> attitude. Yep. Five. 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 <laughs> uh so you you throw che you like try to throw cheese but cheese just kind of like boomerangs back and like knocks you which is for a little guy he packs a punch <laughs> and you go oh, I, I, flying into one of the lasers and get burnt so uh, does everyone see on their sheet where it says uh stamina symbolized with a heart yeah, yeah. you all started with four shadow now has three <laughs> but I I I I I lied. I can't find it. Where is it? Uh, it should be right next to the stats. It's like a little vertical thing going down. Oh, okay. Uh, so that's, I'll that's mark why one off. Can't yep. That's why I've got. I've now got, I've got a burnt Thank ass, you. and I'm like. Ugh. If there's any silver <laughs> lining to this, uh, there should be a spot on your sheet where you can mark XP. Every time you fail, you yep. get XP. Oh, I, I, I mean, g good. <laughs> <laughs> Should take the sting out a little bit. That's why you can't. That's why you can't throw cheese. Think, yep. I don't think. I don't think this. Uh, this, this is coming out anytime soon. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, we are back to the top of uh, initiative, even though we don't really have anything to keep track of that. So it's just whatever people want to react first. Uh, who is next? There are lasers going across everywhere. Well, I tried. You saw my a, a brilliant attempt. Uh -huh. Go on, <laughs> go uh, on. Tails. I always... Yeah, I know, I know. I know. <laughs> right. Tell, 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 yep. Uh, just like, are you going? Right. Are you going for the lasers? You're going for the shutter door. The lasers. All right. Yep. Go ahead and roll. Kick butt with smarts. <laughs> nice. Yeah. That. Uh. uh I'll let... Hmm, how do I want to do this? Uh, I know how I want to do this. Uh, actually, no, there have been no mixed successes yet. Uh, so, you're either... Hmm, how do I want to do this? 
<laughs> you're you're holding off the lasers, but they're not they're not actually disabled yet. Uh, so you gotta like keep your focus on that for now until it comes back around to your turn. Uh, but that will okay. bump the battle counter up to one, so everyone's gonna get a plus one on their rolls for now. For now. Uh, nice. Who is next? Me. Sure. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Um, probably press another button. <laughs> Heck yeah. Uh, no, well, why don't it. you go ahead and add smarts <laughs> this time? Smarts and then Please. another plus one from me. Please read the label um, before you hit a button. <laughs> <laughs> no. 2d6. Plus three. Or whatever your things are. Smarts and... Smarts and then one. another plus one. So oh. plus Smart. So, plus, nice. so, yeah. That's pretty, plus one pretty plus. decent chances. Uh, uh, you, know, you probably don't have any karma points right now, so we won't be able to turn that into a 10. But you do get another point of momentum because you used smarts. Uh... So you're trying to you're trying to open the shutter door, um, but it seems that uh, <laughs> whatever that button was didn't do anything related to the door. It might maybe nearby there's a there, there's a, like some light switches going on and off. <laughs> Someone working in an office. Hey, who keeps turning off the light? <laughs> <laughs> Just a little egg pond robot in a little business suit. Um, well. okay. Who keeps turning off the light? No. <laughs> it, 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 it because I, I'm I'm still quite new to uh, what I've got. So so pressing buttons will always helps me feel. Just it, it helps me. So, yeah, cheese is also it? rapidly pushing buttons, trying to get one of hopefully hoping one of them turns off the lasers. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so the battle counter is at two. So whoever kicks butt next gets a plus two on this roll, uh, which could be shadow. Me. Um. <laughs> Excellent. Um, with my amazing motorbike, I'm gonna try and uh, t do a stunt jump over this <laughs> in my bike and move the bike as ba far back the wall as possible. Yeah. And you know how the fact I've made it into a chainsaw. Right. I, I also add I also add an ejector seat <laughs> just in <laughs> case. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> so uh... I'm gonna try and jump off, ejector seat myself off to the other side. And try and deactivate anything on that side, Got and it. do a do, and do a cream, and just and just start pressing buttons. <laughs> okay, okay. This sounds. Uh, I'll let I'll let you be the decider on what this is. Uh, but if you pick style, you get another point of momentum. Okay, I'm gonna. Uh, uh, it's gonna be style. Excellent. So do I still add the plus one? You in fact add plus two. So style nice. plus another two from me. Okay, so that'd be plus three then for me. Yep. Which is nice. I love the basically the battle counter system is such a good idea. You know how many five E games we've played where the battle just goes on so long because everyone keeps screwing up the rolls? This yeah. is so nice. Oh, oh and also so, an eleven's 11. really good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so and yeah. That's another momentum point, yeah? <laughs> uh that is another momentum point for you. So I I I, I, I basically I get the motorbike and go up on the wall and just start skirting around the wall, ejecting myself off. The motorbike lands somewhere. Right. <laughs> oh. Lands somewhere. And now I'm, I land and I just go, buttons. <laughs> <laughs> and luckily the buttons on this side are much simpler. It's just an emergency <laughs> release button that you can just boop and get rid of it. Uh... <laughs> So, let's see here. Just making sure. Yep, okay, I know what I'm doing. Uh yeah, so with with what you with what you're able to hit, the the laser deactivates and the shutter door comes up. So now you guys are able to go deeper into the base. Uh, e and excellent. How is that? Also let's find where my bike went now, please. Yeah. <laughs> uh go ahead with somebody uh we'll just have well, no, we'll have everyone do it. Go ahead, everyone roll uh, smarts to do a find out more. To see if you can find out where the <laughs> motorbike went. Yep. Yeah, or if you don't want to look. If you want to leave shadow to it, that's fine. 
<laughs> like, yeah, that's so cool. Hey. The bike Whoa. Wow, well, that was a D26 that you rolled. Yeah, that's why. Can you not roll <laughs> an impossible dice? <laughs> <laughs> is it, so is it a bonus or is it just smarts? Now it's just smarts. The battle counter only affects things while in combat. Oh my god. You guys are rolling crocs. <laughs> All right. Who rolled the 13? Me. Perfect. Well, you have you have a fine you have an edgy sense for motorcycles and chainsaws. Oh, no. <laughs> uh uh Cream, you did get a 1, so you get a karma point. Yeah, it was on. Uh but actually, you know what? Now's a good time for me to uh Yeah, I like this. So, but since you failed, why don't you tell me something that's a weakness for either you or one of your friends? And if you do, I'll give you a point of XP. Oh, God. I don't know. Okay. Well, well, do you want, do you, want do you, you to be yourself strong on something? Or do you want us to have, like, a silly thing that we have, to, like, that's a weakness for us? Like, it would be really funny if... Uh, you know, for example, tells can fix all this technology, but is absolutely you know, or like he also is slightly dyslexic, so he might press the wrong button. Also, the <laughs> the player of the character has to agree to it. Yeah, like for example, you can give that, and they they'd they be like, "Oh, that's funny. I'll agree to it." Or whatever. Mm. But that's okay if you like, can't think I'm of anything. Drunk. <laughs> Yeah. It's really hard to know. No problem. Um, I don't know. It's hard. That's okay. I've got something in mind. You you also find the motorcycle, but what you what you notice is that the motorcycle has like gasoline leaking from it. Uh, oh, no. And Shadow hasn't noticed yet. I just gone. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay. Uh, Tails, did you roll a, you rolled a, uh, what did you roll on your find out more? I rolled a nine. Which is a nine. That is enough to get, uh, to get one of the, to get, you know, a clue. Uh, we already found the, the motorbike. Is there anything else that you're wanting to know about the island or maybe even the, uh, the, the boss? Well, uh, Tails being the, the tinkerer, it obviously needs to know, like, all the machinery and all that. It's like... Like obviously blueprints or clues or anything. Yeah. So you're wanting to know more about the uh, the boss or about the island itself? The island itself. Got it. So you're looking, and something seems strange. There, the island. Eggman's a big fan of pollution. He wants to do everything like the the quickest and simplest and dirtiest way possible. So like, you know, big smokestacks and polluting the water to get all the trash out. But this island is. So nice. Uh, like, there's no pollution or anything like that. It's like everything he's running is green here. And it seems like... So, that's strange. Like, why is he so interested in keeping this place nice? But also, it seems like... Those those palm trees? Those are... Uh, you've seen those before. Those are chow nut trees. Like, those are, that's like chow food. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, so that's just things that are strange. Like, why would he have these? And like, why is like this is not anything like nor Eggman's normal schemes. Uh, so yeah, the, that is the information you have, and you guys are able to make your way into uh, the deeper end of the base. Uh, can I can I roll can I roll to see if like my my my, my bike is okay? Yeah, go ahead and roll another smarts. I'm just like, sorry, hope you're okay. <laughs> uh, but I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Start stroking his mobile. <laughs> smarts, yeah? Yeah. Plus two. Nine. Nine. Yeah, that's enough to know that you also see the, the gasoline leak. So either... Ah, if, crap. If, if you or you can get one of your friends to to fix it, then it'll be good to keep going. Tails, <laughs> buddy. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Right. It's leaking gasoline everywhere. <laughs> right. What do I do? Let's see. Hmm. 
that I, would, I hit the gas tank on the way down. <laughs> that would be a that would be a smarts roll. In this game, we call it uh, the move we're technically doing here is called flexing muscles, which is kind of just solving a problem with like either strength or smarts. Oh, Tail only needs one muscle to flex, and that's his brain. Exactly. Oh hey, God! Whoa. Nice. Oh damn, son. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, you get that patched up, no problem. And Shadow's not going to be having any gasoline leaks unless he specifically takes like a chainsaw blade to it or something. Uh, noted. <laughs> noted. <laughs> uh, so yeah, you guys are all uh, good to continue on. Uh, going into the base, uh, it looks like everything. They, there wasn't too many more defenses inside. It seems that it's more of like a storage facility. Um, mm -hmm. And as you're going in, you uh, you notice that uh, as something, some kind of like explosion goes off and uh, you hear these sounds that sounds like crying or like someone like, you know, like panicking, basically. Uh, as it looks like a group of robots are like barging into these like these like storage containers and are like trying to like carry off these like groups of chow like there is like a little group of them are like r trying to run away uh there's another one that's like going into like a like a dangerous part of the factory like with a you know like a cartoon with a bunch of like s crushing down weights uh which luckily it seems to be avoiding but probably not for long and mm -hmm. uh the robots them themselves are trying it seems to be trying to like wrangle up these chow uh, what do? Um, like they're, they're, they're running into like storage rooms and grab with with the chow. Yeah, and they're in a panic. The chow are yes. Okay. The robots. Um, the, the robots seem to be normal. Are they, normal, uh, are normal they chasing them down like with weapons or like trying to round them up? Mostly, it just seems to be rounding them up. Uh, but they do all have weapons on them in case this does start to turn into more of a fight. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> and I take it to immediately turn the robot. You <laughs> better not fail these rolls, brother. Yeah! Yeah! I hit the chow. Oh, no. <laughs> no one hits the chow. Well, I might do. Yeah. It's a big quick scream to unleash the demon side. Yep. If anything happens to cheese. <laughs> You're going to die. If anything, I think I think cheese already hates me. <laughs> so Chow is just giving you like up. <laughs> right, what am I rolling for motorbike? Uh, this would probably be four. So let's be real. Yes, yeah, fair. <laughs> Style to make the motorbike force to. Uh, oh, cream. That's another karma point for you. Uh, luckily, <laughs> it's a seven, so it's not a failure. No, it's not a failure. Uh, the robot is the robot who's got like two chow stuff under its arms. Uh, like jumps out of the way of the of the motorbike and is now trying to ah! run. <laughs> you don't get back here, you, ba you bastard! <laughs> uh, uh, and I uh, and I'm obviously using my attentional scrubs. <laughs> get back here, you. Let's you jump bastard. to one of the other two first. Uh, tails or cream? Cool. <laughs> we all know what Shadow's doing. I feel like there's kind of an obvious guess here, but... Mm -hmm. Alright. What is Tails doing now? <laughs> what is Tails doing now? I'm getting angry. Oh, You're getting well, angry? Oh, God, don't do that. What are uh, you... Uh, let's just uh, assess the situation again, so... There is... Think of these into, like, three different spots. There's a robot running away with two chow. That one. There's a chow cartoonishly going into like a construction site that needs to be saved, and there is a third group of chow who are basically just crying and need help. Maybe like some of them are like well, pinned uh, under something. Well, uh, maybe we can leave the crying chow to cream. So I'm probably gonna say, go after the one that's running with the two chow, I guess. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what? How are you going to uh, try stopping this robot? Alright, then it's time for our Tails to get his two tails in action, I guess. Ooh. Let's fly. Yeah. Uh, are you just trying to, like, snatch the chow away, or are you trying to fight the robot? 
just snatch the chairs well, away first. Get them out safe. Sounds good. Uh, uh, unless you're trying to do this in a particular like, uh, you know, like a like tricking the robot. Uh, this will just be a style roll. But that's a new roll for you, so that should be momentum. Style. Yeah, style. With a nine. 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 Style with a nine. Um. Uh, that is a good start. Actually, uh, yeah, because uh, I forgot the battle counter. That brings it up to a 10. So you are able to just kind of yoink and like pick up these two little chow uh, who were looking pretty scared but are happy to be... They, they, it seems they know you. So, they're, so they, they seem pretty happy and like, uh, like cheering for you. Uh, so, uh, the robot's still there, but if you move fast enough, you can kind of just get away from him. Uh, let's jump over to Cream. Cream, what are you doing? Going over to the, um, frying tree, um, ch chows. Yeah. Uh, go ahead and roll attitude to try to, like, you know, cheer him up. Uh, to... D6... What's that? Attitude. No, I'll think that's it. Plus two. Yep. And that's a ten. Yeah, so uh, uh, Cream and... Um, obviously, Cheese can speak Chow, but Cream can also speak Chow. Uh, so together with you and Cheese's help, uh, you guys are able to calm down the Chow who will give you a big old hug. Uh, mostly because they're scared, but also they really like you. You're really nice. Uh, yeah. So that just leaves the, the robot that was trying to get round up the chow, and also the chow that's going into the construction site. Uh, well, the, the one I was chasing. Yeah. The giant motorbike chainsaw. Yeah, that one. <laughs> get back here, you bastard! <laughs> <laughs> um... Okay, I continue trying to run after it, and then I get on the I I, I deactivate it from chainsaw, pull it into motorbike mode, and initiate the guns on it. Oh, good! <laughs> and now I'm Batmaning it round, <laughs> trying to shoot at them on Batmaning it round. It's fine if you have guns on your. It's, this is the Batman rule. If you have guns on your car, it's fine. Not it's counting as shooting are, people. It's not. <laughs> It's it's a deterrent. It's a deterrent. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> it does what? So what? They go into them several times. Deterrent. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, I, I I've got like I, I'm right. I'm sort of riding round trying to like at least hit them, or with the motorbike, or at least trying to like stop stop them. Um, just trying, you know, uh, shoot enough holes in them. Like they're stopping. Yeah. Uh, this sounds like force. Let's do force. That is very fair. <laughs> it's not force. It's a. Uh, it's a uh, temper. Uh, just what's the word? Uh, spine injuries. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay if I give them concussions. They don't die from those, except for the times that they do. <laughs> you know, major injuries. It's fine. <laughs> Oh, seven. Uh, that is uh, fine. You're not going to, you know, th no failure there. Uh, you, uh, The bound out counter will go up to two, so you guys will now have plus two on your rolls. Uh, no. Oh, nice. Oh, I didn't add an extra one for that one. Oh. That's okay. It wouldn't have been that bad. Exactly. Uh, I, I, I'll bring it up if it actually changes something from a mixed success to a success. Um, yeah. Tails or cream? Uh, are one of you guys going after the robot that Shadow's going after, or are you going to go save that last chow? Well, let's save that last chow. Yep. Shadow's fine. He can take care of himself. <laughs> <laughs> How do you plan on going about getting that chow out of there? Are you going to run into that dangerous area, or are you going to try to like lure the chow out? Uh, I reckon we should just run in there. Sure. Uh, this sounds like a style roll. Go ahead and roll uh, kick butt with style, and you've got my plus two. Well, Let's I'm actually just saying, yep. I am. I'm, I'm saying with Charles to keep them. Oh, oh my god! Hey. Wow. 
Uh, that's a 14, which with my bonus would have made it into a 16. Good God. Uh, God. God damn! <laughs> well, I added the plus two, so your plus two did record uh, it, so... Yeah, 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 you're 14, right. Yeah. 14, yeah. Uh, 14. God damn. So, yeah, you're, uh, you know, you've seen Sonic do this kind of stuff all the time, so you're, you you know what to do. You're able to quickly get in there, time things right so you don't get squished, and scoop the chow up and get them out of there. So now there's three of them in your arms, and they're all like, yay! <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, and then, uh, honestly, if you guys just want to let the robot go... He's not really bothering anybody. The Chow have already been rounded. Like, you guys have already helped protect the Chow. Uh, so All right. Uh, I, 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 hit, I hit it with the butt of my motorbike anyway. Yep. And then drive back. It, it kind of, like, just comically topples over and is having trouble getting up. Just like... Bonk. <laughs> yep. Uh, and I in front of them and get off. It, and I pull it into a... Like a sword holder on my back. <laughs> you guys aren't sure why there's so many Chow here, but uh, it seems they seem to all be safe now. Uh, so yeah, uh, there's always the boat that you can take them back to, or if you bring them to the shore, at least that way they're not inside this dangerous base. Yeah, let's get them out of here. I think that's probably the best option. Okay, let's pr let's protect the little dude. I I don't agree with that. Nice. Just, just so, um, so, Jesus' friends can be can be safe. Yeah. Uh, that's pre. That's E. Dam. <laughs> that's Fred <Fred> Lester. <laughs> Are they all cheese-related names? Uh, please give yourself another point of momentum. That's awesome. Who <laughs> uh, me? No, no uh, me. Yeah. Naming them all cheese-related names. Get, he made a good joke, so I'm giving a point of momentum. <laughs> that's blue. Jeez. Right. <laughs> oh, how'd you come up with that name? Uh, he's blue. <laughs> blue. And it's also cheese. <laughs> <laughs> that one's Adam. G damn backwards. Yep. Uh, so yeah, now you guys are able to make your way uh, deeper into the base. Maybe you guys give them some of the chow nuts so they have a little snack. Uh, and you're able to make your way back... Uh, deeper into the base uh where supposedly this uh this egg renegade mech is at uh, you guys make your way into basically what looks like a boss arena you know a big circular uh -oh. arena when you see one uh, i don't like it when there's a big oh circle boy. yep big circles think of bad news <laughs> <laughs> big uh um, <laughs> menacing I'm red door <laughs> Who knew this would be evil bad guy area? <laughs> uh, though potentially worrying for some of you guys, uh, some of you guys might have a better time with this than others. But the uh, it looks like this place is built with a water tank. There's a bit like there's big like floating kind of like floaty type things that you can stand on, but everything mm -hmm. else is water, and you don't know how go deep it goes. Um. So. Uh, uh, and in the distance, you can see this ro this big robot. It's like it's a little bit more thin than ro than Eggman normally goes for, because he usually makes big round robots that like matches aesthetic. But the big round Eggman face on for the head of the robot, you can tell this is an Eggman robot. Uh, and just like Eggman described, it's got these two fists that are like uh, springs that to like bounce you guys off of it. Um. And it seems to be moving really, like, hard to predict, like, erratically. And it seems to be laughing like a da ha 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 uh, Yeah. Uh, you got, uh, I would like to introduce you guys to our boss for today. Uh, this is the Egg Renegade. Here's oh. how bosses work. It's a lot like a normal fight. There's the battle counter and everything that gives you bonuses as time goes on. But uh, bosses have boss defenses. And you have to get around those to be able to damage the boss and the boss has a number of phases which i don't have to tell you but he does have multiple so uh uh the defenses currently are the spring the spring hands so if you have some way to be able to deal with those or and also the water itself is a defense as it's like moving really fast around it so now you guys have your boss uh there's also just to remind there's always the opportunity to learn more about the boss or things that are nearby something that might help you out uh but now you know and let's let's have ourselves a boss fight 
Yeah. Who is going first? Shadow. Shadow. Why <laughs> I'm the most violent? I immediately have to go uh, fight. <laughs> <laughs> we don't even have to roll initiative. It's just Shadow. Yeah, we we'll just have <laughs> Shadow it's go it's, first. It, it, it's them two just pushing me forward and going, "Hey, man, I don't kill right, everything who's, at once." All right, who's good with technology tales? Who's good with fighting Shadow? Who's good at being cute? Cream. 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 <laughs> <laughs> All three flavors right there. <laughs> Who's named too small and named cheese? Well, there's cheese, white cheese. chocolate, dark chocolate, and dark chocolate. <laughs> God, why am I dark chocolate? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> uh, what would you like to do, Shadow? Um, I'm gonna. I I, I sort of wanna uh, figure out like, like, cause if it's if it's a traditional Sonic boss there are move types that he has there are weak points i want to find the weak points on him i like it so i can be like a bonk a bonk a bonk <laughs> go ahead and roll uh find out more which will be smarts smarts nice i don't care the system shock is on sale uh so can you <laughs> shut up <laughs> Uh, plus two, which is my smart seven. Oof, Kitty. That is a uh, that is a karma point for uh, for cream because uh, there's a one. Uh, but that seven is oh. a mixed success, which no, that still helps you out. Um, yep. So you get to find out one piece uh, piece of information. You want to learn a boss weakness. It sounds like. Yes. Yeah. Uh, just as you uh, just as you intuited, there is a weak point on the monster, uh, the boss on top of its head. Uh, and it also seems that it itself doesn't want to get in the water. Ooh. Yeah. Allergic to water, like most machines. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, now you've got your you've got your weakness, and let's jump to either Tails or Cream. Mm. Tails is a machine. You like machines. <laughs> <laughs> Dis disassemble it or something. <laughs> Right. So let's see. Tails can. So the boss is a what again? Sorry. What's the name of the boss? Eggnator. Or what is the Eggnator? No, the uh, the Egg Renegade. The Egg Renegade. Yep. Let's see. Well, Tails is going to uh. Uh, examine this robot for any weaknesses first. Sure. Typical Tails thing. Uh, say this is smarts. Yeah, go ahead and roll your smarts. Uh, I'm sure Shadow shared that information about the weaknesses, but you still might be able to learn something else out. Head. Big. Head. Or maybe not. Head. Uh, although now you get the idea that, like, uh, let's see. I'm trying to think of like a bad thing that you learned that you're gonna like, you're gonna like try to go after. Uh, you see these, you see these big, these big like things at the top of the place that you could fly to, and it looks like you could drop something onto the boss. Uh, so I'll I'll leave that up to you if you want to share with the class on that. And uh, Cream, it is your turn. Cream. Learn the bond. Learn the weakness. I was trying to learn more about the weakness. You also want to learn more about the weakness? Okay, go ahead. I, I like this. I it, it, this is a very smart party. I was not expecting uh, this much smarts out of uh, everybody. I, I, I was just, I was just gonna say, can you imagine big boss fights? Like, yeah, I'm evil. And we're just like, That's how can we? We're just standing there for like five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> He goes, are you here to hit me yet? We're like, wait a minute. <laughs> Seven. Uh, so I'm actually yeah, I... out of boss weaknesses, but there is something that Kareem would know. Uh, you hear this robot, and it's strange, because you could swear. It sounds like, obviously, it sounds like a, like a robot, like speaking through a speaker. But you could swear that it sounds like Chow language. Mm. And you're not sure why... Whatever's inside the mech would be speaking Chow. Hmm. 
So I will I will leave that uh, for something for you guys to think on. And we're back at the top of initiative. Who would like to do a thing? It's gonna be me, isn't it? But it's gonna be me, isn't it? Do we just want to cool. stick with the order of Shadow Tail Scream? Let's just yeah. do it. Cool. Yeah, you that works what? for me. Makes life simple. <laughs> if anyone um, thinks of something, then they want to cut into order. Feel free to ask the other person. Uh, so you know how uh, this bike basically can do anything, right? D right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the bike also can do the Mario Kart thing where the wheels turn. <laughs> oh, the wheels! Oh, you're talking about magnet. You're like magnet mode. But, but this is for boat. <laughs> ah, it's like a hovercraft. <laughs> Hell yeah. Um, I'm going to need a smarts roll though for you to to establish that. <laughs> Shadow basically. Shadow at least at some point brined tails to add all these features to this bike. <laughs> hey, where'd all those parts to Omega go? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I need all this for my bike. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, I just came across all these black and red metal parts. Could you could you put these into the that is a nine. nine. Uh, so <laughs> no one's actually fighting the monster yet. So uh, <laughs> we're not. The battle counter is not going up. But yes, you now in fact have a wa you now have a uh, a bike that'll traverse water. Let's stick with uh, you. What else would you like to do? <laughs> Get on it. Drift water into its face. <laughs> okay. Oh hell yeah! All right, you're exploiting the boss weakness. Yes. Go ahead and roll style. That was good. That was good. Uh, I was hoping the boat, boat thing would work. Yeah. If not, that was my first attack that I was going to do. I was going to be a bit screwed. Mm hmm. But I didn't have a plan after that. <laughs> style, yeah? Yeah. It's digital style. Fuck. <laughs> A five, yeah, that's that's rough. Um, now is a good time for me to remi to bring up another rule I forgot to mention. Yeah. Someone can uh, can jump in to save somebody when they fail. Uh, they can, I believe, they describe how they do it, and then mm -hmm. they get to uh, they they get to like help them out. One moment while I double check to make sure that's right. Oh man, where'd it go? Oh yeah, it would be uh, teamwork, which is a stat we really haven't gone into. Uh, basically, you can, uh, you guys can all work together in one move and get bonuses from the other people. Uh, but you can also use this teamwork stat to help out other people. So you could roll teamwork, which would be plus two at the moment, to uh, if someone wants to go in and save Shadow before this thing mollywops them into the next Tuesday. <laughs> Before I, before I fall flat into the water that we don't know how deep it is yet. Exactly. <laughs> that would probably be me. I don't know how I'll we'll do that. Uh, you could fly. Um, <laughs> go, <laughs> a, go ahead and roll 2d6 plus 2. That is your guys' teamwork stat. 2d6 plus 2. Yep. Nice. Nice. On a 7 plus, change the original roll's result, so Shadow's roll, to a mixed success. So it doesn't oh, it doesn't hurt the robot, but also he doesn't get hit. So Cream, uh, would you like to describe how you go in to save Shadow, or would you like me to? Um, just uh, 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 flying up and use Cream to uh, um, to 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 um. To help stop the bike from going towards the uh, the robot. Heck yeah, yeah, you're able to like help like steer the motorbike out of the way. Maybe you're like you're like gr flying over to grab on, so you're both kind of like kinda, like almost fighting over the controls, but it's maybe a little bit more of a cooperative thing. And you're able to <laughs> yeah. turn the bike out of the way before the the mech just kind of. It doesn't even really look like it's trying to hit you. It was just kind of flailing and went like <laughs> whoosh, but just missed you. <laughs> Uh, uh, God damn, that was close. <laughs> Cream, you get something. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna give you a point of uh momentum for that. So now you have whatever amount you add plus another one for helping I, out. I I four. Nice. 
So I've got four now. Excellent. Um, okay, so let's jump over to uh, Tails. What do? What do? Hey. Okay, Tails. Yup. Uh, well, I think it's time. What the fuck? I'm giving you a clue what else you can do. I'd, I'd also don't go know what he's trying head? to imply. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Head? Well, go for the head. Go for the head. Okay. Uh, <laughs> spin dash towards the head. Uh, I mean, egg. <laughs> Hit if egg. you do want to go after the head, there is still the springs to worry about. If you have something that you can do to get rid... Unless you want to like try to do something to get rid of those. If not, you might get hurt if you go after the head. But I'll leave uh, that up to you because you can still damage the boss. It just might ha damage you too. Spring. The springs to get up to it, or that's just a cool go. idea. Yeah. It, maybe you could roll a style to bounce off of the springs and get to its head. Mm. Maybe not. Oh, Wrong no. system. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Nope. Like that. Hey, that's oh, a seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's a seven. That's a mixed success, so that is going to that brings the battle counter up to two. And you are that's dude, this is pretty dope. Uh you are instead of it punching you, you're bouncing off the spring, and now next turn you're gonna be in position to clobber this guy. So let's jump I it back. I put the cover all up before. Do what? The karma roll. They got, they got, they got a, a one. Oh, right, the karma. Yeah, yeah, you get another one. Yeah. Nice. Oh, I'm, thank you for uh, keeping on top of that. I totally forgot. Uh, we are back to Shadow. Excellent. Uh, well, I've got, I've got, so I've got cream and cheese on my bike. Yep. Okay. No, cheese is um, hanging on for dear life. He's going like, ah. I put, I, I grab cheese and put them on my lap. Heck yeah. <laughs> um, and uh, cream, I just sort of put behind me so they don't fall off the bike. Because I'm going to do it again. <laughs> so I got oh, control of the no. wheel again. And I'm going to start drifting back into it to try and spray it all again in water. And now <laughs> that I've read what the boss weakness does, uh, I'll let I'll give you a little bit of a choice here. Yes, you can either get a plus two to this move, plus another yeah. two from the battle counter, because you're exploding a mm -hmm. boss weakness, or if you roll a twelve plus, you get the crit effect. What well, is that with the with the uh, bonuses or not? Uh, you'd still get so you either get plus four to this roll, or you get plus two, and you get the crit effect. So it depends on uh, how risky you're feeling. I'll, I'll, I'll go with safe for now. All right. We'll, we'll, we'll see how it is later. Yep. So am I rolling style again? You are rolling style, yes. That's plus five. <laughs> <laughs> so this might... This might, might just work. <laughs> Who knows? I mean, it'll be very funny if I just get a one. <laughs> get one, one, five. Yeah. Ah. I mean, even a one, one, five will still be a mixed success. Wow. Wow. Well, that's another mixed karma success. point for cream. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, at eight, that is. Uh, I'm going to start turning up the heat a bit because uh, we're getting towards the end. Uh, the boss is going to. Uh, is going to like try to throw a punch at you so either you got to give up the bike to jump out of the way with cream or you're going to take damage here um i'm gonna i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna hmm, hmm. <laughs> i have a choice yeah. it's my love of my life or yeah, that uh, thing bye. <laughs> By the way, he's not referring to Cream. Uh, the rogue has a special like goal, and he chose a lover or like something that he like cherishes, and, and I, it's, it's, bike. it's his bike. <laughs> oh, no. It's either my love of my life or that thing. Yep. Uh, 
I go, sorry. I mean, no harm in this. <laughs> Walk him off the bike. <laughs> Keep going, ground. <laughs> so, wait, so you're keeping the bike? Yes. All right, you're getting punched. Uh, go ahead and take another stamina damage. Uh, how do I do that? Uh, just uh, so that heart icon, you should have three oh, checks. Now that. you have two checks. And things okay. get bad if you get to zero checks. Okay. Well, about me because I'm so actually I should, I, I should have that. one. I should have one unchecked box left. Yes. You should have. T uh, there should be two checked boxes. Everything else should be empty. Okay. Good. Uh, well, I think I'm, I'm not behind. I think you are fine, Korean. So I uh, maybe maybe he maybe the robot didn't get you as well as he did. I, sh Shadow. I shoved you off because I realized I'm getting hit. <laughs> oh, there you go. That's nice. I'm re I'm re I'm really start getting hit, and I can repair the bike. I can't repair a friend. By the way, oh, first off, that's I love the way you said that. Go ahead and take another momentum. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm at full momentum, by the way. Oh, okay. I have two things to explain. <laughs> a couple of things are going to happen. I'm stealing this from Glass Cam Podcast. Uh, First, if you ever want to defend somebody, you roll plus style, and that's your turn. And you can use that so that you can take the consequence. You can, like, protect somebody so they don't get hurt. Uh, and then when you have all five momentum, mm -hmm. you get a ring. And what a ring does, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure, will either let you change a roll to a 12... Yikes. Yeah, so either automatically succeed on one roll, ne yep. negate any immediate damage dealt to anyone in your vicinity. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh, I forgot. Do you have the thing, uh, your power type, do you have the charged, uh, uh, the little charge part of the ability written down? Ah! Uh I was going to tell you, yes, uh, but, but apparently it didn't want me to move across my screen. <laughs> yes, charged. Uh, uh, you become more, much more powerful. Nothing can stop you now. <laughs> you can activate that for a short time. Oh yeah. I'll, so that's up to you. If you either want to save somebody, make a make a roll an automatic success, or activate your charged ability. So what can I do? Sorry, repeat that. For uh, reading. You can automatically succeed one roll. You can negate any immediate damage dealt to anyone in the area. <laughs> Or you can trigger uh, trigger your power type charged ability. Uh, okay, uh, uh, let, let, let's trigger charge. Hell yeah. So, so what do I do? Do I get rid of momentum and add a ring or what? Uh, basically, just clear out your momentum and you can clear out that ring. So everything's back to zero. Uh, but now, yeah. narratively, what your XP XP is fine. So you can think? leave that where it's at. Okay. Uh, so yeah, you're fired up now. Maybe you're glowing with it. This isn't exactly a super form because there are rules for that. But mm. there's a maybe you've got like a red glow to you, or you. I'm a Sonic nerd. You, or maybe you pop off those inhibitor rings. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know when he all does that, and he did it in Sonic 06. So I don't know if we care about that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, I, I I basically basically I sort of. The red parts of me just start glowing. Yeah. And uh, I basically do. Um, uh, welcome to Alex the Nerd. Yep. Don't worry. <laughs> we're all there. I, I, I do. I, I, I turn the bike. I look up and I go. Vroom, 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 and I charge up, up, up the upside of the, up the, of the droid, like vertically. Yep. Like it's like a uh, Bells of St. John where he's riding <laughs> vertically up the building. <laughs> As Doctor Who reference for everyone who doesn't know, uh, and I'm basically just going. And, and as soon as I get to the top, activate the chainsaw part of the wheels on the bike, and just start digging into it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Go ahead and roll force. Here with his fucking bells of Saint John. Like, fucking... Doctor Who reference man. in my Sonic game. <laughs> Hello, man. Every, I'm going to include it every time I can. That's okay. true. <laughs> you, you have no idea. Nine. Nine with or, the. Sorry, go ahead, Super. Well, at least I'm not throwing in a bluey reference, but. Yeah, thank you. Yes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Don't give me ideas. A nine <laughs> with the uh, with the battle counter boost that's going on. 
you yep. get there. Yes. You ramp up this thing's back uh, as it's kind of flailing around, and you, at, in midair, change, hop off the motorcycle, change to chainsaw form, and just <laughs> worm right yeah. through. Uh, this, uh, it is able to, like, it kind of, like, accidentally brings an arm up to block it, but you go yeah. through one of its arms and dig into yeah. the weak spot on top of its head. Jesus Christ. It's beautiful. And luckily, uh -huh. it seems that's not where the pilot is. Uh, <laughs> but that's going to skip us to phase three. We're skipping a whole mm -hmm. boss phase. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, sick. Shadow has just gone phase one. Who's that? <laughs> and this is why we let Shadow go first. <laughs> okay. Uh... So now the uh, the boss uh, some some kind of like emergency thing sets off in the boss, and while this thing is ex uh, like calling out something over the speaker, it sounds like chow 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 chow. It is uh, a bunch of fans are activating under the water and are making these big water geysers that are trying to like shoot up and like interfere with you guys. So wow, the t uh, for this final phase we've got two defenses the uh, the the water geysers and the uh the the last spring arm or actually no it's got rockets now it's using rockets it's it's trying to like throw you guys up into the air and then shoot you with rockets uh oh no so we 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 gave shadow a lot of screen time there let's jump to tails <laughs> Sorry, Tails, I heard Tails in that whole sentence. Yes, it is your turn. Uh, is Shadow turn is right, currently so. Kamehameha. A big robot about to make water geysers. Yeah. Mm. Almost like it's doing it on accident. Yeah. Maybe I could, Tails could try and make those waters fire somewhere else to make it. Yeah, man. Let's see. Uh, let's see a smarts roll. Done. We also reset the so uh you will not consider the battle it counter. done. <laughs> <laughs> yep, nope, that is uh, uh that is a five. So unless uh Cream throws in a bunch of karma points here, uh Tails is getting hit. I bought um five of them. So... Cool. If you want to pay two, uh that'll save Tails. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. I'll so, save two of those. Yep. So give you it, give it two. You spend two at uh, that'll bring the battle counter up and tails uh cream is able to save you from or like maybe something just kind of like lucky happens and you're able to avoid like a barrage of rockets coming down at you because you're like trying to like hack into where all the fans are at uh okay next is cream Ooh. I don't know it's really difficult to know what, what to do. Um, there might be something going on with how it's talking like a chow. Uh, if you want to roll smart, so you could uh, you could try to learn more about that, or you can do something. Yeah. To... I'll do the uh, the uh, the smarts because yeah. as, as as I know chow. You know chow. Yeah. What's what smarts? I can't wait to make a that smarts joke when you guys are doing a smarts roll and you get hit. <laughs> that smarts. That smarts. <laughs> oh, for oh. Uh, you could put two That's karma points for that. Charlie with the bluey reference. Yeah. <laughs> There's the bluey. There's the bluey. Fuck. <laughs> Would you like to put uh, two more of those karma points towards this? Oh. Biscuits. biscuits. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, Cream, you you figure it out because you do speak Chow, and this robot is saying, "Help! How do I turn this thing off?" And you realize that the the whoever hijacked this mech is a little baby Chow, who is inside the mech and has no idea what it's doing. Uh, so now we oh, cut inside okay. the mech, and there's this terrified, panicked, like little, like little baby Chow that's just like quickly trying to push all the buttons, trying to get it to stop, 
But that's what's making the robot like swing its arms around and everything. Aww. Yep. It is. It is very scared. Uh. Aww. Uh. So let's jump it back to Shadow. Okay. So um. Well, I I've just taken a massive. Uh, I've just taken a massive dent to this guy. Yep. Uh, the, the entire like head part of it's like caved in. Do, uh, so I'm still at the top. Yes. Um. Uh, no, you would have you would have like fallen back down, but you still okay. have your bike. Do I? Uh, oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> Sally. <laughs> Sally. Um. Do I see that cream? Uh, has a chow inside that's panicking. Uh, if Cream would like to share that information, then yes, you will know that. Yep. All right. That's so yeah, right. now you know that there is a chow that is basically trapped in there. I, I, I go. Maybe I shouldn't have done what I. <laughs> that's okay. The it looks like where the mech, where the where the mech rider is. It's in the. It's basically in the stomach of the mech. Oh, thank yeah, God. I don't, know, I don't know what happened with Shadow. That maybe I should... Uh, did he have a stroke? Uh, what happened? Uh, uh, He's choking on all that edge. Uh, <laughs> who, knew I, who knew my breakfast combines of just ninja stars? <laughs> it's a bad <laughs> idea. <laughs> um, okay. Um, well, I'm going to uh, try and do, do a previous move. And, uh, it, I'm guessing it's the circular room, yes? Yep. Uh, I'm gonna try and basically get the motorbike back on sort of magnet on the wall okay. and run around and try and basically ramming speed through the back of it and try and take take the panic creamed with me that seems the... risky but that's what dice are for <laughs> go ahead and roll style do I get any bonuses you get a plus one to this how Oh, I'm sorry. There's also I forgot about the defenses. Uh, yeah, you're gonna have to, it, so either some either you gotta risk the consequences of getting hit by the geyser or the spring or the rockets. Yeah. Uh, th so there's two defenses. Uh, but if you wanna take that risk, you can go straight for the mech if you want. Um, I'm gonna go straight for the mech. Okay. Gonna, yep. My plan. So I'm adding. So I'm adding what? Uh. I'm adding style, or what did you say? Style, and then a plus, another plus one from me. That's two, then. Be careful. Seven. That is a seven. Uh, so that is a mixed success. So you, so you guys are basically exchanging hits, uh, which means you're you've got you're creating an opening, so someone else is going to get another plus one to their roll. But you are getting hit, and you're going to take another stamina damage, which I believe puts you at Takes one yes okay one more and Yikes. you're out which uh, other team members can revive you but that's just that's one more turn that they're in danger what you, what you mean being edgy and, <laughs> and uh, have a motorbike let me do my let me do my self sacrifice <laughs> uh, <laughs> next is tails all right, Tails will uh, try and stop the water again. All right. Yep. Let's see a smarts roll. Unless you want to think of some other way to stop it. All right. Then, well, that's actually the only thing I can do. And that's fair. Uh oh. Oh yeah, that'll do. So yeah, nice. you're able. You find a panel on the wall, and you're able to start like you know moving wires around. So now you have control of the geysers, and you can cho you can choose where they aim at. They were aiming straight up before, uh, but you get to decide what what they do with now on future turns. But right now they're not shooting, so that's it's not going to hurt anybody. Uh, Cream, you are next. I could see if I could get the chow out, but it could be risky. That would be risky. Uh, there's only one defense now, which is the rockets. So you could either take that risk and go straight for it, or you could try to stop the rockets. 
I could try and uh, stop the rocket somehow. Okay. Uh, what do you? How do you think you would go about doing that? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh smarts. Do what? Oh, smarts. Yeah, I think we could work with that. Why don't you go ahead and roll uh, kick butt with smarts? <laughs> Hit all the buttons. <laughs> Hit them all. Oh, so luckily, with the battle counter at two, that puts it up to a seven. So uh, you're not a uh, you're not able to uh, you're not able to stop them, but you're not getting hit by the rockets either. Battle counter is now at three. We are back to Shadow. Okay. Those rockets are the only thing that seems to be injuring us all. Yep. Okay. More, more example, injuring me. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> who knew? More specifically, me. Um, uh, so I, I, I want to sort of look around and see if it's like, if there's like, if it's a, if it's a bot controlling them or it's an ex external thing controlling them like they're on a timer and they're just being fired on a loop go basically. ahead and roll smarts i'm not adding any battle stuff am i no nope. just because it's a normal smarts roll exactly no am i so enraged <laughs> yeah. i have kept brain <laughs> no nice. i haven't forgot brain uh, so with a 10 plus, I'm going to give you that answer and you can ask another question too. Uh, there's okay. also a list of questions on the, the move sheet if you need some ideas, but mm -hmm. you can tell that the, the rockets are part of the robot, but it's, it, they're their own thing. They will, they will continue to shoot, uh, and home in on whoever's getting near them. Uh, so it's not, the Chow is not ac is not actually trying to shoot you down. Okay. Hold on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like I have crappy internet and I have to constantly jump through multiple hoops. <laughs> you also you don't need to use the the list if you have another idea for a question you want to ask. I just want to have a look at the list quickly. That's fair. I'm just curious. Where are the questions? Uh, it's on. It should be I'll one of the basic. Out more. Yeah. Find out more. Cool. Um. All right. Cool. Uh, we've done that one. Da, 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 da. Uh, is there something? Is it? Is, is there something like hidden nearby, like a, like a big? I don't know. Uh, squash. I don't want a squash robot because there's things still in there. Um, <laughs> that would that would make me an enemy of many people. Uh, right. <laughs> uh, let, let me let's not crush my friend and <laughs> and the two Chow in there. Uh. Is there like I don't know, like a big off switch for the robot? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm gonna say this: uh, there, yes. uh, there is no like big external off switch you can use. But something that is hidden in here, there's a bunch of dynamite in here. There, like it's right now set <laughs> as like a self destruct, not for the robot, but for the base itself. Uh, oh. <laughs> this is an Eggman. This is an Eggman uh, base, after all. Oh, oh yeah, it has. Like, he adds self destruct on the either base. Or something. Yep. But uh, that is uh, that is a, that is something I will leave you with. It is you've seen it, so now it's exposed, so you can do stuff with that on future turns. Okay. Uh, um, tails. You are, I believe, currently. No, yeah, you you are. Uh, near the you're near the water controls for the fa for the geysers but if you want to jump to something else you can and there is only one remaining defense which is the rockets you there Pia. yeah Cool, okay, just making so... sure. Right. I think you was just second for your sheet, wasn't you? Yeah, I was. I gotcha. Okay. Okay. 
explain to me what I can do again. Uh, let me let me set the scene for you while you're looking. Uh, you're in a big boss air area with a bunch of water. There is a chow stuck inside the mech that is attacking you, that is fighting you. Uh, and you got you currently have the controls for the geysers, and there is you still have to deal with rockets that are on the mech, if you want to take a clean shot at the at the boss. Well. Let's use the geysers on the boss. Heck yeah! Uh, go. So uh, this is a this is using the boss weakness. So you can e you either get uh, a plus two on the roll, which will be a plus five, or <laughs> if you succeed, it'll count as if you got a crit. So what? Yeah. So it'd either be plus three, get the crit, or plus five on the roll. Hmm. What do you think, guys? Crit. 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 Okay. Uh, go ahead and roll smarts for kick butt. You have a plus three to this roll. Uh, and and so on top of your smarts. So that's plus five. Oh my god. <laughs> nice. Nice. Blah. Nice. Uh, if only nice. somebody had a karma point that they could put towards this. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> Cream. <Yep. coughs> Shut up. Yep. <laughs> oh, You're doing it? Cool. So that will turn this into a critical success, which means this is absolutely going to... Uh, I mean... I mean, yeah, that's just going to do it. Uh, you shoot the rockets and the mech itself, and uh, the entire thing just kind of, like, powers down and, like, falls onto the surface of the water it's not sinking yet but now you guys have an issue because that chow is still inside ah wait so the robot's down robot, robot is robot down is... you have defeated the boss but can you get the chow out ah. luckily <laughs> we have some we have uh we have cream whose turn it is i can try okay. and get um I can try to get the chow out. Yep. Somehow. Uh, do you have how how would Cream go about trying to do that? That will be either f um, force or force or, or smart. I agree. So I'll let you decide or uh, which one you want to use, or if you want to try to explain how you're doing it, then I'll pick for you. Probably um, trying to um, yank off the, the back. Makes sense. Yep, that'll be a force roll then. No more bonuses for me as we're out of combat. Mm -hmm. Minus one. Oh, is that? Yeah. Super phone. That works. Uh, uh, so I believe. This is more of a flex muscles, which means seven and nine, something goes wrong. Ooh. Yeah, I got it. So uh, I'll set something up in the background. That'll be fun. Uh, but we, you <laughs> and Cheese's help, you uh, especially Cheese, because he can just kind of like, like you know, r like kind of like rip into this thing. But together, you guys are op able to open up just enough of a hole for the little child to like crawl out of there and he is so sad he is crying he's so he's so like scared but uh yeah you're able to get him out of there before the the, the mech sinks yeah okay let's get out of here <laughs> yep I'm gonna uh, press that self destruct button <laughs> <laughs> destroy this place <laughs> that's destroy this place because of um because Hey, will it back. I'm gonna open the door first. I'm not gonna be like, now we're all dying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what's your guys' plan? Who, are, is Shadow just hitting the button now, or are, uh, or what? what's the plan? Open door. I hit button, we run. <laughs> okay. That's, that's my plan. I don't know if these two would approve, but there you go. What, well, are, what are your two's well, thoughts need, on this? Well, I need... Well, I need to get all, all the chows out. One thing I need to do is get in all, all, all the chows. 
That's what a nat runs approval. <laughs> yeah, all the all the chows are out except for this one that you have and yeah. cheese, technically. Okay. <laughs> and this one's Monster. name is Monster. This new one. <laughs> oh. I think um, I think Arthur I think Arthur I'll probably give him another another name if he's a monster. Understandable. Like not monster like scary monster. Monster, monster. is like a type of cheese. Monster. Yeah. Not monster. Monster. Uh M U N. But feel free to go give it another name if you would like to. Uh so uh so Ma Is Actually. everyone is everyone staying in the base while Shadow hits the the self destruct button? I think we should open the door first. The door is open. Get out. Okay. I'm happy to just press button and run the fuck out of here. I mean, I got a bike. I can, I can, I can express my way out of here. Yep. Uh, I can maybe take one person extra and fly, train. Can, uh, um, <laughs> one thing. We both can fly. Elf and I can fly. I, I right. know, but if you want to more, you know, if you... You may not be able to fly fun. faster than he can ride. Yeah, I can ride pretty fast. You might be, you might not make it out in time. Again, I can maybe carry one, two might be expressy. It might be putting too much pressure, and that gas tank already we could. Yep. <laughs> and uh, having ga gasoline line following us after an explosion, I don't have to tell you it's a bad thing. <laughs> who who is going on the bike? <laughs> Shadow, of course. Just Shadow? Yeah. Everyone else flying? Well, I need to ride the bike. Yeah, of course. <laughs> cool, alright. Self-destruct is going off. Yeah. He's about as fast as a bike, so yeah. Uh, so, I need each of you to roll me a make it through roll. Uh, based on... Nice. Uh, yeah. So this is all style. You will all be rolling style. Nice. Come on, Shadow. You have one thing going for you. Don't fuck this shit up. I have zero, so it's fine. Yep. I must have just rolled one d6. That would not have gone well for me. Son of a biscuit! Uh, you do have... Uh, actually, do you have any more karma points left over? I have... You should have... Uh, have... You used three, haven't you? I have, I have four. Right. I, I got four. Okay. Yeah, so, uh... Uh, you could use one of those to uh, get you out of there. Yeah, I'll okay. use one of those. Uh, Tails, bye -bye. You, you, you need to roll as well, buddy. Hey, well, what are we rolling again? Sorry. Uh, style. Style. Maybe not. Yikes. <laughs> uh, all right. So bike. tails. I, that I put him on the bike. <laughs> uh, so unless someone tries to save Tails here, he's getting. Well, no, he, you know, no one's going to die. This is this is Sonic, I, though that's not as uh, obvious as a uh, would be for other series. But no one's going to die here. But he is going to get really beat up, uh, unless someone. Karmas, I could give you um, a few of the karmas. If you do uh, that, that'll be the last of your karma. But you can do it. I have three, so. All right. That could go. Yep. I can use it all three for him. Yep. All right. So you're out of karma, and Tails, uh, you're able, like, maybe you and Tails are working together to get out of there because you can fly. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. you guys, but you guys aren't out of it yet because that was only a mixed success. So yeah. either you keep going and you get hurt, or you think of some other way to get out of here and get a plus one to that roll. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the bike that can do anything. <laughs> Wait, how did you do, Shadow? I got an eight. Eight. Okay, so same deal for you. Either you got to change your strategy and get a bonus, or you're gonna take whatever the consequence is. <laughs> hey, you know that bullshit I pulled earlier with the with the up, uh, upright? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I turned the bike around, and I'm now aiming to go up, right up, through the gap in the ceiling and burst out. I love it. Uh, <laughs> go ahead and give me another style roll with a plus one, and uh, cream and tails. What are your guys' plan? Or are you just gonna take Is the? That, are you just gonna take the bonus damage? or just a normal plus one? Just another plus one. Okay. Uh, along with whatever your style is. Right, what were you okay, saying again? Uh, let's finish with Shadow, and then I'll tell you guys what to do. 
Oh. So that's plus yep. two. Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> come on, buddy! Yep, that's, uh, uh, Shadow is going to be unconscious after that one, but it's gonna... Oh, no! What a cool way to get knocked out. <laughs> um, <laughs> so you're riding out of, like, you're riding up through the top, like, imagine, like, action cam zooming into you as you're, like, going up, and the, the, the cloud of explosion, fiery gas, is right behind you. And you go up, and you just get swallowed up in the gas, like in the explosion. <laughs> yep. Uh, it's, just, it's just a shadow, like a shadow, <laughs> like uh, like form is created in the sh in in the smoke above. <laughs> uh, cream and tails. Uh, either you guys are gonna get blown up, unless you can think of another way out of here. Hmm. What do you think, tails? Well. uh... Tails will look for a way out if there is. Um, I mean, there's plenty of rays if you can if you can imagine one. I'll improv it with you. It's just uh, you got to think of something cool. I would suggest running. <laughs> they were already doing that. That was just flying. All right, let's let, yeah, let's just run. Just uh, maybe run? if there was a window, we can always jump through that. That I will take. Cool. Uh, could I get a? That's cool. Can I get another style roll from you guys with a plus one? Another uh, plus one on top of whatever your style is. Yeah. So that's, that's right. This is dope. <laughs> I love this. Come on. Oh, ah, no. Tails. <laughs> oh, no. Uh-oh. Come on. Come on. And, oh. uh, okay. Well, Cream, uh, I'm going to give it to Cream because that's, that's pretty darn close. Uh, maybe Tails blocks the blast for Cream. But... Uh, oh. You just barely not able to make it through as you guys bust through the window, uh, and the explosion goes off and hits tails. Tails, could you take two stamina damage for me? Uh, first time getting hit. Yep. Uh, but you guys are oh, on the bottom of the top. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm unconscious. Oh, <laughs> uh, so yeah, uh, Shadow and Tails are really badly burnt up. Uh, Cream, you're you're pretty you're pretty banged up, but it's not anything like you're fine. Like you're not actually hurt, you're just shooken up. Yeah. Uh, uh, Shadow, I imagine, is somewhere uh, on a he in a heap on the ground or on the shore. Uh, Bike parts everywhere. <laughs> uh, Cream, you landed by tails, uh, and Eggman is going up to the Chow. <gasps> no. Uh, uh, Shadow's unconscious, so Tails or Cream, what are you guys going to do? Well, first, uh, we should get Shadow oh, out No, I'm there. unconscious. It's them two. It's these yeah, guys. Yeah, that's why we should just get Shadow out of it. Uh, could you roll? I believe this is plus teamwork, so plus two. Unless you just physically okay. want to carry him, but if you want to, like, try to, like, make him better. Yeah. All right. All right. Make him. Just going to try and make him better. Yep. With a 10. With a 10. Uh, nice. Yeah. Shadow, you are back with three stamina. Yay. Yeah. So I just, I get rid of one of my points, or do I just... Uh, you have three check marks. Okay, cool. Uh, so yeah, Tails, you're able to, you're able to help Shadow up to get him back onto his feet. Uh, Cream, Eggman is going for the chow. Uh, what do you do? I would do, um, you're so mean. <laughs> uh, could you, you're using your, you're using one of your playbook moves. Perfect. Could I, yeah. could you roll, could you roll, uh, attitude for me? As, um, attitude is plus two. That is, um, <laughs> Ah, oh, damn it. I realized what I could have done. Not escape. Oh, well, it's too late now. <laughs> That's a 10. Uh, yes. On a, I believe on a 10 plus, you can make the person or any of the people in that area do what you want just because they, yeah. like, find you so cute. But as you're saying this, probably like a Mr. Eggman, stop, like, don't hurt those chow. Uh, just as he's about to, like, go in for him, 
he picks one up and gives it a big hug. Oh, Bree, yeah. I'm so glad you're okay. I thought that I did th any of those mean heroes hurt you. Ah, no, I'm so glad you guys are okay. So, <laughs> it seems that Eggman actually likes these Chow. Oh my god. Uh, but you can... Do what? <laughs> uh, so yeah, it seems that uh, it seems that Eggman's not trying to harm the Chow. Uh, he uh, he he's like petting him and hugging him. Uh, oh, thank thank you all so much for uh so much for uh stopping the egg renegade. Uh, did you did you find whoever was inside? What? Uh, I was like, was some, was some hero, some like wannabe hero trying to like take over it and like trying to destroy my base. It was a chow. What? It was a chow. It's a chow. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah. It's a chow. Oh no! Was it monster? Monster? What if I told you about go going into the me to, to the robots? They're very dangerous. Wait, 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 wait. wait. This what? is your chow. Yeah, they're all my chow. This one's Brie, this one, that one's Monster, that one is uh, Parmesan. That one's Gouda, that one's Goat. <laughs> that one's Gouda. <laughs> so, you own Chows. Well, why, why, I, I didn't why want... Why do you own Chow? Why don't you own Chows? They're adorable. I didn't want to tell you. That would ruin my villain ego. Not my ego, my okay, reputation. I am I am going to tell Sonic. Oh, no, no, I am, please. <laughs> Just get a mobile phone and go snap. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, I uh, see my fingers on the send button right no, here. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Look, you just blew up my base. You destroyed the egg renegade, which I was fine with. Uh, you've caused untold damage, which I'm also fine with, except for the self-destruct. That's a little excessive. But, look, is there some kind of agreement we could come to to have all of this, make all of, everyone forget none of this ever happened? Yeah. Prepare my, prepare <laughs> my, I, I go, yeah, my bike ruined because of your self-destruct. Uh, uh, first off, I didn't hit the self-destruct. I don't know who did. Why do you have a self-destruct button? D just in case the hedgehog comes, and then he he ruins it, and then he mouths off, and he breaks up my robot, so I hit the escape the self-destruct button. By the way, did the robot do really well? Did it, like, did it, like, did you, like, hurt you guys? Did it, like, really rough you up? Do were the traps that it had? Not really. I take, I take one of the wheels that, that can turn into a chainsaw, and I pull the lever on it, and I just get it ready to, like, into it. And you just hear, he just hears the. Okay, okay, okay. I can help. I can help fix the bike. If it, if, if we just all forget that does none of this happened, and no one talks about the chow. Deal. Sorry, what was that? Um, how are you caring for all the chows? Because uh, I've seen, I've seen a lot of trees. Yeah. I I, li they, I brought the the chow nut trees here. They love the they love chow nuts. But uh, I have my robots take care of them. Oh no good. Yeah. No oh good. Okay. And you can Bye. tell all these chow look like they're really well taken <laughs> care of. And he's got a mix of like he's got the little hero chow. He's got some dark chow. He's got all kinds. So it's not like he's like raising them to be like evil minions or anything like that. Uh, okay. Oh, I'm adding a clause. Oh, great. Here we go. Yes. <laughs> the clause is stop making no. evil giant robots that, that, that these guys can get into and cause unforetold damage. Okay. And also fix my bike. <laughs> so the just to make sure the clause is I can continue to make robots, just not, not ones on that... Island. Not on this island. Yes. So they can't cause unforetold damage. Counter offer. I make it a different floor. Make the robots there, and the chow can't go up there. Yes. See? Sure. All I'll right. <laughs> Fist bump. Fist bump me. Maybe some, maybe some secure uh, chow lock. Yeah. Just, uh, like, Shadow's not sure whether to do it. Like... <laughs> yeah, Tails is 100% not certain either. All right. All right. See? Good. Uh, if you want help to look after Tails, I'm more than welcome to help you. That would be great. It seems that you are. It, you seem to be really good with the chow. It's a chow. It's a chow. What do you mean? Not 
Well, we can have a bad, yeah, but... He's the bad guy! I, I, I prefer the term <laughs> uh, galaxy brain genius, but okay. Bad okay, guys are a little rough. He's the galaxy brain genius bad guy. <laughs> hey, okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> Uh, as you as you guys are discussing this, uh, Eggman see like has this like co like communicator device that he has, and it's like blinking red. And he looks down, and he's like, "Oh, that's not good." And we what cut you got there? cut to black. We're gonna <gasps> cliffhanger that for maybe a dun, dun, dun. future Sonic R and R S session. We need to get more people in this. Yeah, what did you guys think about the system? Oh yeah, I love it. Yeah. Yeah. Love it. I love that Shadow has just hit things thinking about compliments later. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, the the these guys have a like a pre-made like little tutorial adventure. Uh, so I can run that in the future. Would Hell you guys yeah. would you guys want to end this now or do you guys want to see how the ranking system works? Cuz I'm just I'm just right? adding I'm just adding notes to the bike. Chainsaw boat Magnet wheel. <laughs> yep. Uh, because, of course, you can't have a Sonic game without rankings. Yes. Please. But I will leave that up to you unless you guys are, you know, uh, low on time. Uh, I, I, it's up to these two. If they want to stick around for a little bit longer. I don't mind. We should be able to do this pretty fast. Yeah. Uh, these guys. Do you guys have the move sheet up? Uh, I have it on my phone. Uh, uh, the the separate drive folder, I presume. Uh, it's like uh, uh, it, it's in it, sheets. It, yeah, it's in the it's in the Discord on the sheets. It's in Discord in sheets. What? Yep, like general sheets, not Mario or uh, Pokemon. Yeah, general. Let me flip you. Uh, oh, yep. I see what you mean. Go ahead and open that up and go to the second page. There's like a picture of like a dude playing a video game, uh, and you will see the end of stage rankings. I'm gonna ask. I'm gonna have each of you guys in order ask me a question from that list, and I'm gonna give you a yes okay. or no. And the <laughs> amount of yeses that I answer is gonna give you guys a higher ranking. I think. Hey. I, I think I have a couple. <laughs> <laughs> that I didn't do. Uh, <laughs> Charlie, do you see the uh, do you see the 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 move sheet that has all the like basic moves and everything? Yeah, I'm showing this for stream. The yeah. Cease checks channel in Discord. Uh, don't worry, we'll also be reading them out. Uh, so while she's looking at that, I'll I'll have you two go in yeah. order. Uh, starting with Super, what is the first question on the end of stage rankings? Uh, was there a task accomplished by teamwork? Yep. So that is one answer. So, so currently, click on. Yep. Go ahead and fill that check mark. Uh, currently, you guys are at a C rank. The worst you can do. Uh, yeah. did you guys find an unpredictable way to solve a problem? Oh wait, sorry. I, I don't know why I'm reading it out, but I guess I'll take a turn. Uh, I don't. I don't really think so. I think you guys pretty much did this in the Sonic style, which nothing's wrong with that. Uh. Alex, could you read the third one? So is that two uh, tick boxes or just one tick box so far? Did you which one? Which one? Which was the last question you asked? Sorry. Uh, unpredictable way to solve a problem. Am I am I reading the wrong question? Aha! Uh -huh. No, Found could it. you save an innocent from danger? I think you were trying. Yeah, to... that's that's that, that's that's the next one I see. Yeah, go ahead and read it off. Uh, did you uh? Uh, did you save an innocent from danger? You did. That is two check marks. We, we saved those shells, so. Uh, Charlie, do you have I the? Save shadow. Do you have the questions up? Yeah. Um. Page two. This, this part. Yeah. This part of the sheet. Page page two of the blue section. Yep. Yeah. Bottom. This part. Uh, could you read off that fourth question for us? Did you show off in front of the boss? Unfortunately not. What did you do, Shadow? Name it. Up the wall. I don't oh, think that chance. was showing off. Chainsaw. That was just cool. Which is, like, you know, important, but not worth XP. 
Uh, Excuse me, it skipped two boss phases. That's uh, it, yeah, that was the reward. Uh, <laughs> super, could you read the fifth one? Uh, did you force the boss into a monologue or find information about their plans? Well, if you count it as just going chow, chow, chow. <laughs> chow you chow, that chow. does in fact count. You guys have three. You guys now have a Woo. B rank. Yay! Uh, Alex, could you read the next one? Oh, oh, yeah. uh, oh, uh, oh did oh. you did you create or resolve a uh, connection with with the boss? Um, not really. I don't we, think we saved so. the, we saved the chow, but. Yeah. Wasn't really. Yeah. Uh, and then, uh, Charlie, could you read off the final one for us? Did you find a creative solution to to the pro Yeah. To a problem. Yeah. Was that one? Yeah. Yeah, oh. that's the one. <laughs> there is a different. I am looking at a newer version of the sheets. Uh, <laughs> that's fine. Uh, so, uh, did you guys find a creative solution? Yeah, I'll give it to you. Um, Batman, boat, chainsaw, m motorbike. <laughs> yeah, chainsaw, <laughs> motorbike's a pretty creative solution. Uh, are there any more questions? Uh, one more. Was, there, was, was a personal it? goal reached by any of the heroes? Um, I mean, not really. Not really, and even if, even if I did give it to you, that'd still be four, so you guys still have a B rank. Uh, that's not too bad. But yeah, that's not too bad. bad. B is very acceptable. Bad. And you all get two XP because you got to be ready. Yay. 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 So Yay. now, it, w if and slash when we do this in the future, you guys know what to look for when you're do while you're in a stage and fighting a boss. Oh, biscuits. Because oh. you know that that'll get you more XP, which get you mm -hmm. some sweet level up stuff, even though they're, they're called mm -hmm. improvements in a, a PBTA game. Uh, uh, hey, XP. Yep. So I just click on two squares here. Yep. Yep. Well, on improvements. Yeah. We're not in improvements in XP. I was just talking about how the improvements are very cool. I can't find XP. I'm being. Oh, it should be oh, there. One, uh, two. It should be on yeah, I've got, I've got free XP. Wait. <laughs> nice. Uh, and that is going to be our session for today. Uh, hey. Did, did, has anybody have any feedback on the game that they wish to. I can't, I can't open the file. That's fine. We'll work on that after the stream. Okay. Uh, I thought the game was great. I love how it gets people to like get out of their comfort zone on what stats they're good at to do other things. And I yeah. love rewarding momentum. It's so much easier than giving someone inspiration because it's baked into the game instead of just a little like uh, shoehorned in thing for 5e. And also... Mm. All of the moves are references to things in the IDW comics and in the games. It's so cute. It's not cute. It's like good inspiration. This is, this yeah. is, they're not trying to be cute. They're trying to like make a cool game. Well, unless you're cream. Right. They, they, they did a very good you job. To be cute. Uh, you guys should read the clumsy moves. You could spend, if you pick the right ones, you could spend three karma points and change a rule <laughs> in the game. Nice. The, they just they get to like break the fourth wall and stuff. It's amazing. I, I what I was gonna say was the one thing I forgot to do was not going down like a chump, which <laughs> I could have done when I was riding up the wall. That would be pretty <laughs> cool. For the fiery explosion, uh, which basically was like you're about to be down from an attack, bursting the building. Yep. Uh, you can burst that in a range of motion and negate that damage, potentially getting a small opening to escape. Which would have helped me quite a bunch. Uh, <laughs> also, my move is burnt, and I would gain the momentum. And, yeah, nice. and I, then I can change my ability type as well. So that would have been fun. Well, um, I'm glad you all liked it, and who knows, we might be able to get this into a future uh, Saturday type thing. Uh, if you like this video, give it. A <laughs> If you do the like and the subscribe and comment about what you like the most about Sonic Rings and Running Shoes. <laughs> but yeah, no, I'm totally be down for this. Um, I, 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 might be our new Wednesday slot. Who knows? Well, maybe every so often. Maybe every so every often. Every so often. All right, Who everyone, knows? have a good night. Oh, oh shit! I got Ooh. enough people that I can raid somebody. Who's live? Do it. Do it. Do well, it. At this time of day, I would suspect one person would be. 
Let's uh, take let me a look. I don't know. Let I don't see that, are they? I'm on it. Uh... Raid. Nope, he is. They're he not. They, uh, but Graham is. We raid in. He is live. Everyone, <laughs> have a good night. Alright. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye, right, goodbye. So do I go home or I stay for the raid? Uh, do, do, do whatever the heck you want. I, uh, you're gonna be well, there anyway, well, aren't uh, you? The raid already happened anyway, so might yeah. as well. You're gonna stay. stay you're gonna stay there now, aren't you?